Okay. Let's see if that works. Hang on a second. No, not you, Wolf. Sorry. Okay, it seems that that has worked. Let's see. Okay. Here's if that works. Okay, cool. I seem to be live. And people are in the chat. Excellent. Hello, everybody. Thank you for coming by. I'm still doing a little bit of setup. <clears throat> okay, cool. Oh, chat is popping off. Whoa, 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 whoa. I've never seen I've never seen chat move this quickly. Give me one second. I will be I will be with you shortly. What I need to do now is I need to set up my TikTok. So give me one second once i have both streams open i think this is going to be a lot for me but i think i can do it so let's see you just let me know i have my chat open so let me you just let me know if anything changes so then i go tiktok stream and then i go file settings stream no output no general no video video and then doug says it 1080 by 1920. Is that right, Doug? I trust you. 1080 x 1920. Okay, how does that look? That is correct. Oh, I don't know why I would ever doubt Doug in my life. The dumbest thing anyone can do. Oh, but it looks wrong. Doug, are you sure? Doug here. Are those really the right dimensions? Hang on. This looks wrong to me. Oh, it's because I have no bottom. Straight. Right. Is that right? Oh, we ran into a problem. Uh oh, hang on, hang on. Uh, you all give me one second. The TikTok dimensions got messed up. Let's just go ahead and... Fine. I gotta readjust the dimensions, team, because it seems... Okay, I, I know what happened. Give me one second, y'all. Give me one second. Because my dimensions got messed up. I, I know exactly what I did wrong. That's my fault. Okay, cool. Oh. Sorry, uh, give me one. You all can't see what I'm doing, but I'm I know what I'm doing. Okay, like this, and then this. Is this how we did it? This should be bigger, like this, and then okay, then this. down and then this is me and this is down thanks so much for the two dollars uh seventh dimension i really appreciate that okay is this what i wanted uh let me just make some moves here and just make sure that this looks correct oh the this oh no this is wrong wait yeah yeah okay 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 that looks better uh, this might be slightly wrong. Oh, everything got messed up. My fault. Um. Okay, let's see what happens if I do this. Where? I think we had this at the bottom, actually. Mm, it's too late. Mm, if I put this like down here, how does that look? That's what it was. I thought it was like sandwiched between it. Although it might be too low, but I think it's okay. Okay, cool. That should be good. Okay, sorry. I'm. I, I. This is my first time doing this. Um, and there's a little bit of an error here. This and this. I know you all can't see me just yet. I know you can't see what I'm doing. I'm sorry. This is. Um. Okay, cool. So then, next thing I need to do is I need to go to TikTok. Sorry, this is quite complicated. Whoa, Black GX. Thank you so much for the fifteen dollars. Hong Kong fifteen dollars. Thank you. Thank you. Um. Yeah, thank you. So, yeah, sorry, y'all. I'm almost done setting up here, and then I should be good to go. So, let me just... Okay, let's see. If I hit go live now, what happens? I hit gaming. It doesn't let me choose my game. Pokemon. Pokemon is not a console game. Oh, it's here now. Pokemon Sword and Shield. Perfect. Upload... Mm. 
Okay, topic. Um, number one, getting to number one in the world with a gear. Getting number one in the world. Number one. In the world. Save and go live. Okay. Now I have a server URL, which I will copy and not show to my chat. Settings. I'm almost ready. Other. Custom server URL is this. And stream key is this. Okay. And then I hit start streaming. And if I have done this correctly, I should be good to go. Okay. I think I am good to go. Cool. So now let me open up TikTok on my phone champ. And make sure that everything looks good. Don't want to watch TikToks. No offense to these lovely people. I am live. Okay, I think I am good to go. I think I'm good to go. Hello, everybody. This is my first first ever simul stream, which should be a little um, challenging, I think. Uh, and also, first ever YouTube stream and also first ever TikTok stream. So thank you for stopping by. We have about 20 minutes before we can really jump into this properly, before I can really get going, but um yeah today i'm going to be trying tonight i should say i'm going to be trying to get rank one in the world number one on the in-game ladder in pokemon sword and shield with um not this with a team featuring magirna uh magirna is a pokemon that is only it's the first time it's ever been legal this is only the second month it's ever been legal and frankly it probably won't be legal for a long time again um And so I'm trying to get to number one in the world with it in the meantime. Depending on how these streams go, like I can't say about the future, but yeah, if the streams go well, then yeah, maybe we do more of this in the future. So in the meantime, thank you for stopping by um, the stream. Um, and I'm happy to answer any questions. We've got about 20 minutes here before I can hop on the ladder, I think. Let's just confirm that. Make sure I'm not burning precious time. And I'm going to be doing my best to follow both of the chats, but um, it might be difficult. <laughs> It might, it might be difficult. Uh, let's do ranked battles. Yay. Cool. Ranked battle. Oh, I can't do it. All right. Okay, cool. So we have about 20 minutes. We have about 20 minutes. And I think I need to give mod permission. How do I mod this? So we had a couple donations. Um, Charlotte, thank you so much for the... Oh, thank you so much for the kind words. I really appreciate that. Um, thank you so much. Thank you to Jordan as well. Yo, uh, you're the best Wolfie. Any plans to make more content like fixing the bug type? Not in the not in the short term. I, I, but I am ex I, I am experience, uh, experimenting a lot with my content at the moment, and so um, I can't say for sure what's coming in the future. Um, Roger, thank you too much for, too much for the ten dollars as well. I really appreciate that. Thanks to everybody. <clears throat> What do you, someone, uh, the color green on TikTok says, what are you most looking forward to? Scarlet and Violet. I think really terrestrialization, the new mechanic looks really cool. That's what I think right now. I think I'm really excited to be playing in kind of like a more, I don't know, regional, regional metagame. Like, cause it's just so different than what we've been doing. Um, thanks so much, Seventh Denim. I really appreciate the $5 and, and the kind, the kind words. What's the time in the US? It is currently 1137. So this will start at midnight. Uh, Ty MC says on TikTok, Hi Wolf, your collab with Alpharad inspired me to take a look into VGC and competitive things. That's really awesome. If, um, I'm really happy to hear that. Yeah, I love showing people how incredible competitive Pokemon is. So it's it's really nice to hear what, like the people that my content can do that for people because it's had a pretty big uh, impact on my life. So I love I love that other people can explore it as well. Uh, Beanie, thank you so much for the for the five dollar donation. For all of you who don't know, Beanie takes really really incredible photos at events. Um, and you should totally check them out. Um. I am looking at my screen on TikTok and I see something that says yummy, yummy, nom, nom. Now, I don't know what that means, but maybe some of the, I, so I'm not, I don't, I'm not like a boomer, but I am a millennial. So maybe some of the zoomers in the TikTok chat can tell me what yummy, yummy, nom, nom means. What are your hopes for Magirna? I just hope this goes better than last time, honestly. So this, I, I have, I have tried this before unsuccessfully. I would love to teach Ed Sheeran competitive Pokemon, but I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't hold your breath personally 
favorite pokemon game to replay emerald probably i, I replayed emerald more than anything else whoa 20 dollars from alexander let me see love your content wolf super excited for vgc and scarlet and violet hoping fairy type gets an extra weakness and that's i thought you were gonna say that it gets a buff and i was like Ooh, i don't know about that hoping fairy type gets an extra weakness and that it's as easy to prep competitive as sword and shield were oh, me too that's my big thing is um um i hope that i really hope that competitive pokemon only continues to be more accessible i think it's one of the biggest barriers is that it's pretty difficult to get a team in game any thoughts on the auto battles they announced i'm not entirely sure what the auto battles are um maybe you could uh, illuminate me what pokemon do you get in the mystery dungeon test i forget i, I haven't i haven't played a mystery dungeon game in a while i was thinking about replaying explorers of sky though um it's showing street fighter 5 in the description on youtube what's your bagel tip topping i have a weird i have weird taste in bagels i like i like plain bagel I hope Incineroar is deleted forever. I would like if um I would like if Incineroar were like lost Intimidate. I think it's a bit too good right now, personally. Congrats on the Beast Coast signing. Thank you very much. Whoa, holy cow. 120 oh 129 Mexican dollars. I don't know how much that is, but sounds like a lot of money. Thank you so much. Your video with Jaden got me into competitive, and I really think you're a very wholesome person. I love your perspective. Thank you very much for the kind words and for the support. I really appreciate that. Jaden and I were talking today about potentially doing um potentially doing some collabs when um when Scarlet and Violet come out so I'm excited what do you think of Wiglet uh I think Wiglet is really funny I love funny Pokemon who wins in a fight a gorilla or a bear I think I could take them both personally what do you guys think I think I could take them both what do you what do you all think I think I could take them both surely I could take them both right a gorilla and a bear I I I get in an argument with people sometimes because I'm like I'm sure I can beat a bear in a fight I love Magearna but the ability can be broken 100 percent agree how do you feel about parental bond coming back as an ability? Uh, I haven't. I don't think that's been announced. Yeah. <laughs> All right, cats. I see you. What about a, about a barilla? What would that even look like? Is phalanx possible to, to be in competitive? So here's the thing about competitive Pokemon. Context is really important. I'm going to stop reading the chat for a second. Um, just so I can focus on this. So context is really important. So a po like a Pokemon can be super good um, at the beginning of a format when like less Pokemon are viable. Like I used phalanx a fair bit when um sword and shield first came out but as more pokemon become legal and as more as you know the power level of a format increases or of the game increases it becomes increasingly harder to use more niche things unless they do something very specific so um basically the best time to, if you if you're like oh, i really want to use this kind of like weaker pokemon the best time is like right after the games come out because like everything's less optimized and the pokemon are just less powerful overall i want to get into australia vgc comps where do i start learning more um there's actually a v an Australian VGC player with your name, funnily enough, uh, that I'm aware of. Um, but for Australia, I'm not entirely sure. But I will tr maybe somebody in the chat knows to like find a local community. You can always use the event locator, but I don't know how useful it is right now. Um, TikTok, how how is it looking for you all? It's gonna look better. I will say it will look better once the actual battle start, which I can't do right now. Why did you put Street Fighter Five as the game you're playing? How do I change that edit video? Give me one second um how do i this looks like a video how do i change that customization uh close how do i uh how do i uh how do i how do i uh how do, how do i uh where does it how do i do you think people will just know oh maybe it's under show more Gaming, game title. Okay, I didn't. I don't. This has no game title right now. Let's see what happens if I put Pokemon Sword and Shield in. All right, you let me know. Okay, it should be fixed now. You let me know if that changed anything. Beard needs to be more clear. What do you mean by that? What? What? What could that possibly mean? Please, please eliminate me. Please elucidate me. Okay, how do I watch? This? Okay. All right, close it a chat for to do that. Looks like I missed some donations. Let's see. Oh no, I didn't miss any donations. What Pokemon do you wish you could punt across the Pacific Ocean? Easy one, Smeargle. So puntable. Uh, how do I mod? Let's just try... Hey, Cats, what's your name on YouTube? <laughs> it didn't work at all. <laughs> okay, let's try it. Let's see if it works on TikTok. Oh, man, that did not work at all.
Did that work? <laughs> okay, well, I'm out of ideas. <laughs> um, I'm super out of ideas. That was all I had. Oh, wait, Cat, can you type something? Wait, maybe? Wait, hang on. Wait, wait, I can click on your name. Okay, what about, click these three dots, report. I don't have the option to mod you, but I, good news is I can report you. How do I mod you? I can send you a message. Uh, I am I am afraid that I have exhausted my technical knowledge. Can you type something on YouTube? Wait, let's just click a random name. Okay, well, none of these names are clickable. Well, that doesn't help. Oh, wait, three dots? Okay, put user in timeout. Hi oh, add moderator. Okay, Cash, can you, I can do it on YouTube. Can you, can you, can you say something on YouTube? Typing words. Okay, wait. Now everyone else stop typing. Okay. Typing add moderator. I hope that this is the right person. Okay, I have a moderator now. TikTok, don't do anything stupid, okay? Because I don't know how to mod you people. I can block you. Uh, maybe you can't even have mods. Make a Pokemon on which uh, make a video on which Pokemon will be good thanks to terrestrialization. Um that will definitely come out. I think what I'm so I have a couple ideas for videos. Um one thing that I'm thinking about doing is um going through every single poke when the games come out of course and i have some time to actually like sit down and figure out what's good um going through every pokemon and saying what the best terra type for it is that's my that's an idea i have wolf not canada i don't understand what that means would smeargle break the new mechanic no something like she ninjas more dangerous nat three dog five one twelve and tiktok says how wolfy why wolfy you just click on the username i did that but it only gave me the option of blocking what are you using to stream with face cam i am using um uh my computer i'm using a desktop computer i don't know if that answers your question Dar Durya. i don't have the option what's up wolfy i hope we get to battle you someday for sure Favorite game you've never played in channel? Uh, never played in the channel. I don't know. Maybe a mystery dungeon game. I don't know. I, I pretty much only played Pokemon for a long time. I got a haircut or style that. Yeah, I just put some stuff in. I wanted to look good. Okay. Okay. Guilty. You got me. I wanted to look cute for you guys. What can I say? Guilty is charged. I'm excited for cloth. Uh, <laughs> I think it looks funny. I like, I love cloth as a design. Do you hope they bring back national decks and DLC? Not particularly. The thing is that like, as a competitive player, national decks is like not inherently a good thing. Like when you, it's basically, okay. Like casual players love national decks for obvious reasons. But the thing is that, um, I'm not live on Twitch right now. I'm live on YouTube. If you want to watch widescreen and I'm live on TikTok if you want to watch short vertical, whatever it's called. Um, what was I saying? So, so casual players, I'm generalizing here, so forgive me, okay? But like in general, there's kind of two complaints, right? There is against Pokemon. Uh, okay. If you are a player who wants to bring back national decks, you also have to accept the fact that like the more Pokemon are in the game, the less creativity, the less room for creativity um, there is, if that makes sense. Because the, the higher the overall power, the more Pokemon are in the format, the more likelihood there is that there's a stronger Pokemon, right? More Pokemon, stronger Pokemon, etc. And the more, the higher the power level, the, the more like your favorite Pokemon gets pushed out, right? Right now we have Pokemon like Zacian, Caloric Shadow, Kyogre, Groudon. Like if your favorite Pokemon is Leafeon, who's not even inherently a bad Pokemon, like you can't really do anything with that. You know what I mean? Um, So yeah. Will Mr. Fish come back in substance 100k? I have I have Mr. Fish in my closet. Uh don't take that out of context, please. We got about 10 minutes left. And then we'll be able to actually play some games on here. I wish I had three monitors. Less Pokemon means less options to fill a role. Uh not exactly. Okay, here's the thing. Let's like. Okay, we have Incineroar right now. Incineroar alone invalidates, like, because of Incineroar, 
because Incineroar exists, you'll never use Hitmontop. You'll never use Scrafty. You'll basically never use Salamence. You'll never use Gyarados. These are all Pokemon that fill Incineroar's role. Crocodile, you can't use Crocodile. Like these are all Pokemon that are like, I would say decent. And because Intimidate is so good, they're actually quite okay. Um, there's a bot. Mod check. Mods? My one mod help. Where's the bot? Oh, I see. Yeah, get them. <laughs> get them, Scarlet. Could you please do a collab with Yon? Um, yeah, we we I love Yon um we talked about doing a soul link but it's a lot of time hey wolf i lost on stream to you last month did i get my revenge <laughs> please don't stream snipe me <laughs> okay wait i can i can do it wait wait stop, chat stop talking i'm trying to mod l wait how do i do it i forgot add moderator i have two mods now on youtube i think vgc is better without restricted mods so i won worlds in a restricted format so maybe i'm a little biased but i would be okay never playing with the restricted pokemon because i think that it is more appealing to the casual viewer and i think that that's a really i think that's something where pokemon is really under underselling so i would be okay playing without restricted pokemon because i think that it's um thanks to the five dollar squirrel i think that i think that it's i think it's a, a worthwhile trade-off i'm also not playing with stream delays so please don't snipe me because i'm trying to get make this a good experience What do you think about Wiglet? I like Wiglet. I'm down for Wiglet. I'm a Wiglet believer, you could say. Should I get Scarlet or Violet? Uh, too soon to call. Way too soon to call. What was your favorite season for the ladder and sword and shield i think it's kind of hard to say because like because of the pandemic we ended up playing a lot less you know what i mean like i played a lot less of the format like i only basically played um yeah what are we waiting for we're waiting for another 10 minutes when the ladder resets and then i can i can't i cannot play right now so if i hit the a button look at how good i am at clicking the a button it says uh season has ended please wait till next season i have to wait 10 minutes before we can play did you ever shiny hunt frequently? No, I am not a shiny hunter. I find it tedious and uninteresting. Basically, I understand. Wait, what? Wolfie, I saw you at Cheesecake Factory after you won Worlds, but too scared to talk to you. In 26, I remember going to the Cheesecake Factory in 2015. I don't remember 2016, but I mean, if you saw me there, then I believe you. I will say that I look, I have a very generic uh, look. Like I, I look like a lot of people. Would you ever do a spike month cup also ask love to get trouble for youtube streams yeah i definitely um i i feel bad i've been like uh <laughs> I, I double messaged ludwig because i um well i can't tell you why but um yeah if, if once once that's taken care of then yeah i can ask him for trouble Are you looking at doing YouTube streams more? Um, uh, it's gonna depend on how this goes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest, y'all. It's gonna depend on how this one goes. Um, this is this is data collection for me for both YouTube and TikTok. Um, so we will see, we will see, baby. Thoughts on on Arma Rouge and Ledge Confidential Dog? I don't know. I don't know anything. It depends on stats. Um, we were fight a TikToker. Yeah, when Cybertron starts making TikToks. <laughs> um. I can't leak anything. Sorry, not leaking anything. Um, what's your favorite Pokemon? I don't know. It, 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 roll, it rotates. Um, here's the thing. I thought about doing more Nuzlocks, but right now I'm trying to make good content and I just like, I don't. Okay, here's, there's two issues. Number one, I don't know why you would watch me for a Nuzlocke rather than like everyone and their, and their you know, uh, grandmother is doing Nuzlocks right now. So I don't know why you would, why you'd watch me for it specifically, except that I'm, you know, funny and entertaining and so beautiful and smart and clever and charismatic and uh they're so humble as well but other than that i don't really know why you'd watch me uh personally oh wait does my button work wow, wow. can you all hear that because i can't world is that doing anything baby. can you tell me i bet yeah oh oh uh, i don't know how ranking how ranked battles will work in sword and shield when when it comes out can you hear that 
Are you a Wiglet stan? Um, I'm holding out. I haven't, I haven't fully made up my mind. Has anyone ever told you that you look like Lin Manuel Miranda? I, I, I do, yeah. I do get that. A lot. <laughs> Your content has been fire recently. I really do feel like I really do feel like my content has leveled up, especially recently. Wow, wow. We hear it, but it's quiet. At least it's not too loud. Okay, is this one? Wait, is this one? Okay, wait. Everyone, stop. I'll look at TikTok because it's easier to follow. Okay, YouTube, you calm down for a second. You, you're in timeout. TikTok. I'm gonna press a button. You tell me if it's Wawa or World Champ difference. Okay. Wow. And don't lie, because I need to know. Because I need to know which one I'm pressing. Because I can't hear it for some reason. I gotta talk to Nick. I don't, I, I, not only can I not make it any louder, I also don't know, I don't know how to make me hear it. Which one is this? It's wow, wow. Okay, so this one's wow, wow. wow, wow. And then this world one is world baby. Different. Here's the real reason I don't do more nose locks. Number one, they're pretty time intensive. Number two, they don't interest me. Like, basically, I was only interested in Emerald Kaizo because it was so challenging and it brought out the, like, I don't like nuzlocking. What I like about what, and I loved the Emerald Kaiser nuzlocke because it was all about game planning, right? Like, it was like this giant puzzle, and you had all the information um, accessible to you. So, like, you, I, there were documents with like every like like I understood the AI. I got to the point where I totally understood the AI, and I totally understood what my like, and I had like a list of Pokemon, and and I knew all of the teams of the other trainers, and I like with that specific combination, I could like plan out every single fight and like know exactly how it would go and that was super fun for me i loved that um the thing is like no other nuzlocke that i'm like for the time investment that i would need to like do another nuzlocke like that it would have to actually be challenging because like i tried radical red before hardcore, hardcore mode and it just didn't require that level of planning so i just didn't like didn't care you know what i mean um and so i need i like basically i will do another nuzlocke when platinum kaizo comes out that's my next one what is a rose? Ro Roman Rivera, thank you for the roses. I don't know what that is, but thank you very much. 25 roses, thank you. I don't know what that is, but thank you. Anyone know? That's on TikTok. How's your cat doing? He's so cute. I love him so much. He's so cute. I really love him. You should try chess. I don't know, guys. I, I don't know. I like it sounds like it's pretty intense right now. It sounds like it requires a real level of uh, commitment. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know. I, I would say that it's more of a full body experience that I'm willing to invest in. You know what I mean? <clears throat> hey, Wolf, I just want to say I've been watching your stream for a few years now and you helped me get competitive. Can't wait for Gen 9 comp. Thank you very much for the kind words. Ramon, thank you for the five roses. And it looks like Desher's also sent some roses. Thank you so much. I really don't know what that means, but I'm sure it's good. So thank you very much. Really appreciate the support. I'll show you the cat if he comes in here. Um, that might be difficult because the door is closed, but I have faith in him. Oh, I got a... Yo, I didn't tweet out that my first ever stream was live on YouTube. I'm so... I, I was like, I'm sure I'm forgetting something. Okay. Uh, wait, give me one second. Uh, uh, um, oh God. Oh, oh, geez. Oh, okay. Wait, local disk, users, wolf. Okay, don't use this attack into my computer. Document? Um, now. There we go. I'm a gear now. Okay. Um. I forgot. Okay, four minutes. Everyone hyped? Any hypers? Someone asked if I needed Edners. I I just brought two very talented Edners on full time, so I don't know if I'm currently in the market, but it, well, I'll definitely be looking in the future as 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 um like we have I've I've brought on also a very talented scriptwriter, which takes a huge amount of the burden off of me, and so like we have extra bandwidth, but I want to get I I want to both of my Edners are like truly phenomenal, like eleven out of ten, and so the bar is right, quite high right now. But if if another person came along, I would definitely consider it. Um, where'd you end last season? Nah, you know, cash. Let's just say master ball rank. Let's just say master ball rank. What's a good counterization? Um, it, it depends on what you mean by counter. Like, zation is hard because there's not a lot that outspeeds it and KOs it. Um, and it's super bulky, but you, there's ways of lowering its damage output. And Sinnoh is a great check. Um, uh, what else? Um, 
things that can burn it or loads attack are useful things that threaten it like Groudon is a good like can often 1v1 it if it doesn't miss um reflect is useful of course will-o-wisp is good <clears throat> okay um oh is, is jack here jack my boy how you doing brendan thank you so much for the kind words uh, i really appreciate that glad you're uh Glad you're enjoying competitive Pokemon. Can I get it for you? Dog, you are... I, I couldn't afford you. You're too good of an editor. Uh, big fan of your content. You got me super interested in competitive Pokemon. Did you see? Oh, good chat. It was too fast. Over the past couple years, wanted to ask for your thoughts on Wiglet. It's cute. How could you not like Wiglet? Wait, Jack's here. Jack, what do roses do? I've gotten I've gotten a couple roses on TikTok. What do they do? 2,000 people here is pretty lit. I'm not going to lie. 2,000 people in, on YouTube, 1,000 on TikTok. That's kind of that's kind of hype. I got a panda now. What are these roses? What type wheel do you want the new starters to have? It's a tough question. Um, fire and what? I think fire, water, water, grass, and grass fire would be cool. But I don't think we'll do it. Make a Pokemon auto chest? Me? <laughs> what are you telling me to do? Rose equals bits. Oh, thank you. Okay. That was so good. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, okay. I gotta start. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna, you know what I mean? I'm just gonna, you know, I've got such a way with words. That's why you that's why y'all are here, right? That's why you you all are here. It's not because of my prowess with Pokemon, right? Glaley, 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 Glaley. Honestly, it's pretty incredible how good I was at saying Glaley, given that it's actually quite difficult. Like if you're alone or if someone is sleeping next to you, try saying Glaley a bunch. It's like kind of hard. It's very guttural. You have this weird, like, what is it? What's it called? Uh I knew it's this in chorus. Gla, like gl gla. That sound, it's like a is it a diphthong? This is going to be a VOD. So right after this is over, it will go on the VOD channel. Well, not right after it's over. Some point when it's over, it will go on the VOD channel. And then if if it goes well, which there's no guarantee, then it will get turned into um, it will get turned into a YouTube video that's edited. Emmy, thank you for the five dollars. <laughs> Sorry, but, uh, I'm not. I'm, this isn't like a. I'm not going to stream on Twitch. This one, please work. I did not check this. Oh, thank God. Jason, thank you for the twenty dollars. Uh, Metagross moves to the Meteor Mash and Headbutt. Uh, hang on, and Headbutt. Press uh, Body Press with Adam X Attack and Events. I think it's good. It depends on the format. I could totally see it being good in a certain format. Uh, I got to switch into actually using my brain mode because I have not played a bunch of this. I have Regieleki. You know what? Let me just fully do this properly. That was wrong. Hide sidebar. Okay. All right. We'll think. I'm playing against seventeen cats in a trench coat. Um, Zation looks good here. That's the first thing I noticed. Zation looks really good here. Um, Kyogre looks pretty solid as well. Um, I think I like Zation, Kyogre. I kind of wish I had Incineroar here. You got to bring Magearna, right? It's the Magearna stream. You got to bring Magearna. Uh, and Yveltal. The issue with leading Kyogre, though, is that... Is Yveltal even good here? It's pretty good to Zygrade, right? I don't remember what moves are on my uh, thing. Ugh. I think that I want to lead Zacian. They're not going to lead Zacian and they're not going to lead Zacian and Zygarde, right? So I can do. Can I do this? Um. Yeah, you know what? We, we we ball. We ball. Okay, let's take a second to think. So part of this is let's let's use this as an opportunity to for me to learn as well. So I think right in this game, there's a couple ways that I can win this. I can sweep through with. My, I think one of my early goals should be get, to get as much damage on that Zacian as possible because the Zacian is probably, with the Pokemon I've brought, I think Zacian is the biggest threat, personally. All right, here we go. First game. <clears throat> Magirni of Veltal. Interesting. What did I lead? I led Kyogre Zacian, right? Okay, that's not bad. Um, it's almost a little bit difficult. It's a little bit difficult because I don't know. I have like almost too many options here. <clears throat> um, so Kyogre and Zacian. Looks like actually one of the viewers is in the chat. The viewers in the chat. So please just do me a favor and please uh, don't, don't not for a while. Like just mute me. Any any muters. Um. <clears throat> I guess the question is, who am I more afraid of here? Am I more afraid of Yveltal or am I more afraid of Majirna? 
In the long run, I think... Wait, is Shaman allowed? I don't know. Um, I think in the long run, I am more worried about the Yveltal here because the Magirna can't control its speed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to double into the Yveltal. The, that's probably Magirna given it's in a Cherish Ball. But the thing is, my thought process was basically... <clears throat> if they max Magirna here, okay, they do. Um, they, they shouldn't be able to knock out Zacian in one shot. And after the Water Spout chip damage, um, I should be in a spot where I can... Okay, cool. I was mostly just worried about Sucker Punch is the truth. Okay, so we just get rid of Yveltal for free. We get great damage on Magirna here. This is all solid, I would say. Um, we are going to give Magirna a boost, but it isn't the end of the world. At plus one, it really shouldn't be able to take a kill. And even if it does, it would only be able to KO Zacian. And even then, I could just max Kyogre next turn, most likely. So I think it's okay. Here's the boost, though. Here's where things get scary. It doesn't have a ground move. Oh, uh... Well, I didn't know it got a grass move. My Kyogre is not especially bulky. Uh, well, that's actually really bad. Hold on a second. That's actually really bad. Um, I targeted the wrong Mon. The issue here is they can easily go into one of their fake out Pokemon. And then I'm just really... I didn't realize that Kyogre could get KO'd there. And now it's plus two. Um, okay. Ugh. Ah... Uh, I mean, I have to go Magirna here, right? I go into Zygrade, actually. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're big chilling. I don't think that Thousand Arrow should be super threatening here. Okay. Uh, I can take out the Zygarde with Play Rough is the truth. So I could go after Zygarde here, but I th think I really need to target down this Magirna. So let's do this. I don't really see a reason to delay... The mm. I think I do want to max Starfall here. Okay. They didn't switch. I think the switch would have been bad for me. This truth. Where's your back currently? Uh, back's not quite against the wall. We'll, sa we'll save that for later. Which game? This is Pokemon Sword and Shield. Well, I guess this is technically Pokemon Sword. <laughs> Okay. This should KO, right? I mean, I don't know my Magirna calcs, but I'm pretty sure that plus one just KOs. There's a lot of static. I will fix... Okay, I, I know how to fix this. Bye-bye. Uh, I'll fix it after this game, and this game is ending imminently, so... Yeah. Yeah, I can fix that. Sorry. Okay, that was an arrows. Not a big deal. Did a little bit more dization than I expected in all honesty, but I just have a pretty low estimation of Zygrade. Okay. KO for Big Nagirna. And now this is kind of the, the beauty of Magirna, right? We saw it in turn one when they got a, when I got a KO on the partner and then they got a KO right back. It is possible for me to lose this, but it's... No, it actually shouldn't be possible. Um, If they're faster than me, we might have a problem, but I think we should be okay. I'm also not positive that they'll one-shot me. I'm also not positive they won't forfeit because it's a 3v1. Okay, they didn't forfeit. Okay, I'm faster. That, that seals it up. But yeah, basically the thing about Magirna, so for those of you who don't know, Magirna has a it has a unique ability. It's an ability that, that uh, is unique to only it. It's the only Pokemon in the game with this ability, and it's called Soul Heart. Now, the way that Soul Heart works is that whenever any Pokemon on the field gets knocked out, faints, goes back to its Pokeball, um, Magirna gets a, a special attack boost, which is the stat it uses to attack. Magirna, you are awful. What? Okay, then, then you're fine. Um... And the reason that's relevant is that there are some Pokemon, of course, like, um, I don't know, like all the all the Ultra Beasts, like Cartana and Blacephalon and Stakataka, who, who have an ability called Beast Boost, which get they get a, if they ever take a KO, they get a, a boost. Um, this is also true of Calyrex. If it gets a KO, it gets a boost. So why is why is Magirna special? Well, the reason that Magirna is special is that Magirna doesn't say if this Pokemon gets a KO, it gets stronger. What Magirna says is if any Pokemon faints, 
does Magirna get stronger? So if, if Magirna's partner faints, for example, like what happened turn one of this game, Magirna gets stronger. Um, and so that, that that's just for a lot of really interesting situations. You can intentionally let your partner get KO'd. You can like KO like their partner Pokemon and make Magirna stronger. There's a lot of combinations you can do. Um, and so it's a really interesting Pokemon and it's never, ever, ever legal for a number of reasons in part because of its ability. So this is one of the only opportunities we have to use it. And it's it's a really interesting Pokemon that kind of changes the dynamic. Now, let me really quickly quit out of this and pray that the next one works. So, I, so I, hopefully this will fix the audio. And if not, I can try something else. Cool. All right, cool. It's it's yeah Riku it's kind of like a sweeper but it's 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 a, a little bit more than just a sweeper because it's just you have to be so careful maneuvering around it because it's just so easy to let it get going right explosions another thing you can intentionally KO your partner something like destiny bond is a really good partner for it ideally um I don't know what's going on but it's nice having you talk in the background thank you very much thanks for stopping by the stream I hope you're enjoying really hope you're enjoying the stream <clears throat> all right let's see who we're dealing with Mitchell oh no um okay okay that's not Calyrex though that's spec that's isn't that Spectrier is that there's no there's no guy in the back um okay let's think about this I probably don't want Reginald okay I definitely want Yveltal the problem is that there are dual very scary electric types um I like Magirna, I like Yveltal, I don't like Aleki, but can I really afford to bring Kyogre here? I could get kind of cheeky and do Kyogre early, but Sogaleo is pretty spooky is the truth. Why don't I do the issue is that ugh. Who do I leave here? I definitely want Grimmsnarl and I would really like to set up screens. Um I would love to Dynamax. You know, I don't normally do this. I don't <laughs> I don't normally do this. Oh, why don't we try leading off with Magirna? How about that? <clears throat> we'll leave Zacian behind. I think that's okay here. There, Yveltal might be a little problematic if I do this. Um, but I have Magirna. Yeah, I think it's okay. A horse, but no dude. Is there a reason to play Spectre over Calyrex? No. Uh, no. I don't think so. I can't think of a single good reason. Reggie Lucky Zara Aura. Okay, that is quite interesting. Um. Ugh. Um. Okay. Who's more threatening in the long run, physical or special? I'm really worried this is this. I'm probably covering something that's too niche. I'm really worried that this is Plasma Fist and Explosion because it would just knock out both my Pokemon. Okay, no max. We don't want to see fake out here. That's what we're really worried about. Okay, we got Reflect up. That's honestly great. Plasma Fist. Okay. Wait, if it's faster than Aleki, does that mean it's Scarf? Is it Scarf Zerora? Kaboom? Oh, wh wait, sorry. I didn't even process. It was an explosion. I guess the question is, is it Scarf Zerora? Because that's kind of relevant to me. It killed through a reflect. <laughs> okay, we trade one for one. <clears throat> you thought you thought taking out Grimstar was in your favor? So this is what I mean. Magirna used Protect. It's Scarf. That's really bad, actually. That's actually super bad. Okay. Ah, that's so bad. Uh, um, um, I didn't bring an electric resistance and I didn't bring a Pokemon that can protect itself. So I guess, I guess it's just Kyogre comes in here. We sack Kyogre and then we win with Eveltal. Cause once, once the electric types are down, I'm Bing chilling. It's old Galio. That's fine. 
Is that fine? Um, is that fine? Mm, I might live because they reflect. Basically, my I have reflect up, right? I could max over. I'm just gonna go for Origin Pulse here, and I think I have to Starfall. I don't love Starfalling here, is the truth. Do I have to Starfall here, or could I Dazzle Gleam? And then Max Javel Tall. I probably have to. I probably shouldn't be greedy here, right? I should probably just go Pulse and Starfall. I I'm just worried about weakness policy, but I think it's probably okay in all honesty. I could be wrong about that. Okay, they max first. Not surprising. <clears throat> Look, a max quick into Magirna. I'm, uh, yeah, that's not what I'm worried about because I have Shukaberry. What I'm worried about is that Spectre in the back, and I'm worried. I'm worried about Bulldoze plus Fast Solgaleo. I don't remember how fast my Evoltol is. I don't. Max speed of Solgaleo is faster than max speed of Evoltol. So just, if it's Jolly, then I'm in trouble regardless. usually Scarf, Zara, Bandaleki. Yeah, I would figure as much, especially given that it killed Grimmsnarl through, uh, what's it called? Oh, we have a lot of viewers on TikTok all of a sudden. Did we get a raid or something? What happened? Why do I have so many viewers? I'm not sure what happened on TikTok, but, uh, if someone hosted me, thank you so much. Sorry, I'm, it's really hard to keep track of both the game and also... Ah! It's Scarf, guys. Don't worry. I figured it out. Kyogre? Oh, Kyogre lives? Okay. All damage in the Sogalea is really valuable in all honesty. Oh, I crit. Don't mind if I do. Actually, getting the survive there is pretty bad. Although being plus three is pretty nice. Oh, I have reflect though. <laughs> Big damage. Okay, behold, make the power of Magirna. Magirna, stop holding back. Show the Sogalea what you can do with plus. That did a lot more than I was. I was building this up because the joke was going to be it wouldn't do any damage because it's plus one special defense Sogaleo and it's in Dynamax and it resists Fairy, but it actually did a, a lot more than I expected. So, um, good job, question mark. Oh, <laughs> Oh, Grimmsnarl, you make me laugh. Oh, Grimmsnarl. I win. Grimmsnarl, Grimmsnarl, Grimmsnarl. How quaint. Does competitive Pokemon make the games easier? Yeah, it does. Wait, we have more viewers on TikTok than YouTube? What's going on? How's everyone doing on TikTok? Have you, uh... Did he just max card? Did they just max card? Excuse me. Sorry, bad habit. Um, light screen, that's not going to save you, buddy. They max guarded. That's not a great use of your turns, to be honest. Oh, big damage. Your live is on the For You page. Hey, love you stopping by. Thank you very much. Uh, my name is Wolf. I'm a competitive Pokemon player. Ah, I, sh I shouldn't be modest, right? So I'm streaming on YouTube with, I guess, most of the people who know me and streaming on TikTok with people who don't know me. So I'm the best Pokemon player of all time. Um, and don't check my recent world's performance because that's not relevant to, the, the, to, 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 to that statement. Um, but yeah, my name is Wolf. I'm the best Pokemon player of all time. Um, I make competitive battle, battling content. I make a lot of other content now too. If you love Pokemon, you should follow uh, or subscribe. Big damage. And right now I'm beating up a big uh, Steel Kitty with this big clock monster. What the heck is Magirna? All right, watch this. Big damage. What do you have? Any, do you have any questions about uh, competitive Pokemon? You should let me know, because I, I, I would. Uh, I'm happy to answer them. I love. I love teaching people um, about the game. I think it's really, really an incredible special game. So um, yeah. Wait, it lived. I wasn't looking. I, was, I think I won. Okay, well, this is a little awkward. I was talking all the smack, but Togolio is still around. Um, please, ex please, please, please excuse me for a second. All right, but this is actually great, actually, because now I can look at the chats more. What's your favorite competitive Pokemon to use? I I've always liked him on top, to be honest. I think it's a really cool Pokemon. Favorite gen to play competitively? Gen 5, but Gen 8 is number two. What's the best way to get improve in competitive battling? I would say watch a bunch of content, honestly. You got to know what other Pokemon are going to do before you can really start to win. What's the game name? Pokemon Sword. Can you do the YouTube intro? I could do the YouTube intro. I could do that. Um, 
<clears throat> let's think here what should i sing um real youtube is stream at midnight i hope i'm not up until 5 a.m you think someone who's only done a fire nuzlocke could beat emerald kaizo I, my only nuzlocke before i beat emerald kaizo was pokemon emerald base for me is sylveon relevant and competitive at all right now no but in a couple months it might be How's it going, Rachel? Oh, oh God. Okay, this is a team. I don't. Uh, uh, um. Okay, this looks really challenging. Um. I think that I want to do. Okay, probably not a lucky, right? They don't have intimidate, which is a good thing. Um. I think it's these two as a lead for sure. Uh, the truth of the matter is, I'd really like to bring. I think I'm gonna do. Okay. I think. Who do I leave behind? Do I really leave behind Zation here? It does so much damage. Like, this is tricky because I definitely want Grimmsnarl up front, but the problem is I don't know who to pair it with. Mm -hmm. Like, Yveltal's pretty good here, Azation and Magearna, and I, I think I can get away without Kyogre. I think I can get away without Magearna. What is Magearna doing here? It's really good trick room insurance. I need to bring Magearna, right? Because otherwise I'm just screwed. Kyogre is fine, but it's a little bit. Yeah, I, I think I think I'm gonna do this. It's a little risky. Do I really want to lead off with Zacian instead of Yveltal? Well, I'm running out of time at this point. Um, it's a little risky. It might not work, but I'm gonna give it a shot. You ever have a buzz cut? No, I, I've always liked having hair. So I, I I'm emotionally preparing to go bald. I don't have any signs yet, but I just feel like I'm gonna go bald. How do I see my concurrent viewers on TikTok? Because I think I have viewers reading this. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Um. Oh god. Okay. Oh god. Ugh. Okay. Let's think about this. In the long run, Z uh, ugh. Kyogre goes first with Drizzle. Does pressure come out? No pressure. So it's telepathy. Okay. I mean, I've just got to go for light screen here, right? And I think I should go for damage into the Kyogre. It's pretty straightforward. I think I need damage on Kyogre because I, I have some faith that Yveltal in the late game can be strong. And I have Magearna to help cover for um, Calyrex Ice, though that won't help Yveltal stay alive. I, I just really hope I can get both screens up, but it's not super likely, I think. I have no understanding of competitive, so this is going to be fun, fun to watch. That's the goal. That's totally the goal. Okay, they're taking their time. They're thinking about it. It's kind of a tough decision, right? Because you, you, okay. Dusk Ball. What do we think, chat? Do you think this is Kyogre? Or we think this is Dialga. What do we think? Send me a shout out, please. Thanks, Roman, for the, for the, yeah. okay. It is Dialga. Okay. This is going to be a problem, but it might be salvageable, question mark. Okay, we as okay, we need to connect this player up. We connect. Excellent. It's a lot of damage on Kyogre. Oh pulse hits both. Okay, I'm losing a Pokemon this turn, but I'm not losing both. Which is nice. Did a ton of damage, even through light screen. Okay, I'm losing Dialga. I mean I'm losing Zacian. Um Is it Life Orb? <sighs> Folks, this one's going to be tricky. I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, let's see what the item is here. It is Life Orb. Okay. Oh, this one's going to be tough. Um, They have Zacian, right? I'm pretty sure. don't have a Zacian. Oh. 
That's very interesting, actually. So they don't have a station. It's Calyrex, Yveltal. This may be a mistake. I don't, I'm not convinced that this was the correct move. Okay. I kind of want a Kyogre to protect itself there. Okay. It's not Scarf, but I would have I known it was Scarf, right? So Kyogre goes down, but I'm going to take a, I'm probably going to lose a, uh, my Alongar here this, this turn, like Grim Snarl. Strike, actually. Okay. Into Yveltal. Okay. Interesting. So that confirms, so that's actually a really interesting move and it might not seem interesting to you all, but it's quite interesting to me. Um, to me, what that does is it confirms that this is, it, it, this Diogen does not have protect, which is gonna be really relevant in a second. <clears throat> this is gonna be challenging. This is gonna be super challenging, but I think it's doable. This should be Calyrex, I think. It is Calyrex. Okay, well, you've got the pieces. So how do you clean this up is the question. You've got all the pieces together, right? Oh, that's right. I don't actually have, um, right. I don't actually, mm. I don't have trick. I forgot I didn't have trick. In which case, just like we ball. Chat, do we ball? Can I, can I, can you tell me right now if we ball? Cause I could just try and take the KO on this Calyrex. I think I have to do this. I, I don't love it, but I think it's what I got to do. <clears throat> if this goes wrong, I'm losing. I need this to one shot. It'll one shot unless they're like a sash or something. I don't die to that. There's no way I die to that, right? No way. That's the power of light screen. So now what happens is it depends on if you Veltal gets the one shot here. If you Veltal KOs Calyrex in one move, I think we're in pretty good shape. It might not look it, but I think we're in pretty good shape. Yveltal moves next. Here comes foul play. No berry. Sash. Okay. All right. Okay. <clears throat> and now I lose both Pokemon. And Calorish gets up to plus two. Let me know right now. Do you think that we can win this? I'm down one Pokemon to three. I see a lot of GGs in my chats. You don't believe? Nobody believes here? Okay. All right. Okay. I see how it is. Nobody nobody has faith. Nobody has faith in the... Uh... Actually, no. I'll wait to push the button. No, you guys are right. You don't know me. You, you're right. What do I know? You're right. This is doomed. You're right. What could little old me do? Please don't be grounded him back. Please don't be grounded him back. Please don't be grounded and back. Hailstorm, Steel Spike. Wait, Hailstorm Strike? Hailstorm, Hyper Beam, Flash Cannon. It might not have a ground move. And if it doesn't have a ground move, then... That was a really good play. Ah, oh, I, I didn't even know. <gasps> it's no dragon move. Please don't drop my special defense. Okay, that's fine. We are probably doomed. Okay, I didn't. Okay, sorry. I didn't expect helping hand Calyrex. That's my bad. They used Quake. Oh, you're right. You're right, chat. You're right. You're right. Okay, I lost. You're right. Okay. I've never seen me win these, etc., 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 etc. Please be Yveltal, please be Yveltal. Tornadus? Yveltal? 
I've seen better things. I'm not going to lie to you. I have seen better things. Okay. That's not good. Um, I think I definitely lose. <laughs> um, special defense plus one, special attack plus one. What are my best odds here? Helping Earth Power at about 40%. So it does. I gotta I gotta get a one shot on Groudon, which doesn't seem super likely. Right. Okay, here comes the Shuka Berry. This isn't gonna do that much. I'm gonna do like 20%, maybe less. I need to miss a P Blaze. Miss, 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 miss. Wait, 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 wait. Plus one max starfall. There's no way this KOs, right? There's no, there's no way. Oh, but it was kind of close, wasn't it? Wow, I was kind of close. Ah, I was so close. I was so close. Uh, I think it's a salt fest. I think if it wasn't a salt fest, I would have been fine. Ah, oh, they were pretty good. I lost. Yeah, yeah, I know I lost. Okay, technically it's not impossible. If they're, yeah, it'd be pretty difficult to win from here. In all honesty, this Dialga messed me up. Okay, yeah, okay, that's it. My bad. But if I'd KO'd ground on there, I would have won. I almost wonder if I was better off attacking into Dialga with Starfall there. Like I needed to, I don't think it would have KO'd. Maybe it would have, I don't know. I think I should have attacked into Dialga. I think I made a misplay at the end. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It was a hard matchup, honestly. And the, the Sash helping hit Calyrex was not part of the plan. I do think that I probably should have just hit the Ghost Sauce with the Evolve Hall. Like I needed to match the Evolve Hall there is the truth. Well, especially once Kyogre took too much damage. But live and learn. I don't know. It was, it was kind of tricky to know at the time because I did want to win with my gear in that, in that position. Hey, Zenzibar. Go live on Twitch? No, I'm, I'm not. I'm, I'm alive on YouTube if you want to watch long, long uh, wide form, whatever it's called. Okay. Okay, let's see. This is interesting. They also have both restricted Pokemon or both Groudon and Kyogre. Um... Yveltal is really good here, except for there. Wait, if Yveltal is so good, why don't I? Uh, I really want to do these two is the truth, but they're just really bad into. Let's try the. Let's try these. These should be good, right? Um, I think that this should be a strong combination. I can always pivot into Groudon, set my screens up. No McGear in this fight, but I think it's okay. This really isn't. I think I, I don't think I was supposed to bring McGear versus the last team. No, they had Calyrex. I think I was supposed to bring it. <clears throat> Why did Shukaberry not activate on the Helping Hand? The reason is Calyrex has an ability called As One, which is a combination of both the Unnerve ability and the Spooky Rider. What is it called? Chilling Nay ability. Um, and the Unnerve ability says no berries are allowed. Your opponent berries won't activate while Calyrex is on the field. So the Shukaberry didn't activate because Calyrex was still alive when, <clears throat> when yeah. I also don't think you're allowed to stream live on both YouTube and Twitch. Okay, that's honestly a great lead for me. That's pretty much a best case scenario. Um, I have Kyogre in the back and the Hall. So we got to think about our long-term plan, right? I have Electroweb here. Um, what else could I do? <clears throat> I could set a light screen up. Um, I could go for Reflect. I could go for... I almost wonder if it's worth spear breaking the calorics here, right? I think I want to do that. I would love to set light screen up, but I actually think that in the long run. No, I should set light screen up. I should, set light screen up. I should actually set light screen up. Because I, I, I definitely like. Yeah, I definitely should set light screen up. Hundred times victorious. Never seen that one. So it was a good switch out. Um, I just hope that they don't protect because if they protect, things get a little dicey, if you know what I'm saying. But if they don't protect, I'm kind of big chilling, you know? There's a lucky Okozation. I'm counting on it too, so I really hope so. <laughs> I'm really counting on it too. Uh-oh. 
Wait, I didn't. Nobody told me they were good. Hold on. Wait, nobody actually. Actually, nobody told me they were good. That's actually really bad for me. Um, that is not good. That was a great move. I, I could have played defensively, but the risk reward was just not worth. I could have protected and like, yeah, but I don't know. Um, okay, so we know three other four mons. We we actually can probably infer the last one too, right? Wait, why am I worried? They're just gonna miss Keyblades. blades. Do I live Keyblades blades after reflect? Probably, right? Probably. I bet I do. I bet I do. Or you like he's dope? I bet I do. Let's go for reflect, and if if I don't survive, then they'll just miss. That's my plan. They were locked in quickly. All right, we're taking Zacian here, which is good because my goal in the long run is to win with Kyogre. The problem is if they have their own Kyogre, that plan gets a little dicey. Take, take out Zacian, which is great. Um, they're going to miss. They, they hit both. Oh, I love Reginald. Oh my God, he's so good. Okay, cool. So we're up in Mons. We're down in, we're up in Mons. I would say we're down in tempo. That's my assessment is the truth because the thing is that um i see the vision i hate to see it but i really see the vision Oh, I didn't see the vision. Oh, I messed up. This was the I, I had a, I was a false vision. Ah, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. But I, I really thought they'd put Calyrex there. But I was wrong. I've been wrong before. I'll be wrong again. So basically, what I did there was I I sacrificed. I was gonna max guard with the lucky, but I decided instead to get some damage on Groudon, which is important um and to lower the speed stats and switch in my eveltal so why is this relevant right I, maybe it looks good to give up my dynamax pokemon that's not great in a vacuum i agree with you but the thing is by lowering the speed stats i've now put my opponent in a position where um it gets a little bit tricky for them because now i've got kyogre and eveltal and because i dropped the speed stats of both groudon and caloric shadow um that groudon is a salt fest by the way um, what that does is it allows me to do something like this, which is just foul play and water spout, both into Groudon. Um, we don't know for a fact that this Calyrex, mm, I have life enough. I can probably afford it. Basically, I, I, I always water spout here, right? Um, and then the question is, what do I do with Calyrex? Because now they're in a position where I don't think that Groudon can protect itself. If Groudon can't protect itself, then this is probably my best move. Um, and I'm faster because of that max strikes. Oh, that feels good. So, so that's like a that was an example of like really really good posi offensive positioning where you you basically yield your short term positioning by sacrificing a Pokemon switching out like letting your last turn of Dynamax end and in exchange you win the game um because your the opponent is in a position where they don't have anything to deal with the offensive pressure at all and I respect that the opponent realized that because yeah like they didn't even Dynamax but it 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 wasn't really relevant um. How do I see how many viewers I have on TikTok? I don't know. I can only see my total viewers. I haven't played that player, Bobby. Sorry. Oh, my button. World Wait, isn't this the same team I lost to? Okay, so this is a Trick Room team, which is spooky. Um, it's a Trick Room team with the Alga, which is also spooky. Um, it's a Trick Room team with Among Us, which is also spooky. Um, okay, which Pokemon am I bringing here? I think it's got to be Zacian. Oh, shoot. The thing is, I really want to do Max Magearna here. Um, Zacian, Magearna. I probably don't need Kyogre. I definitely bring Yveltal and Grimmsnarl, I think, of the four Pokemon. Yveltal and Magearna. Set up screens and then try and win with Magearna and Yveltal. Um, I think that's solid enough, right? That should be solid enough. Old Hungar, 350 viewers on TikTok. I thought I was popping off because I was looking at the total viewers and I thought it was total current viewers. I was like 6,000 viewers. But 350 is not bad. Um, 
Among Us. They brought Among Us. They brought an Among Us. Oh, y'all, they brought Among Us. Chat, there's no easy... <laughs> there's really no easy way to say this, chat, but they, they have Among Us. Chat, I'm so sorry. I don't know how to tell you this. <laughs> they, brought, they brought them on, chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, what do I do? We think there's any chance that it's... Okay, basically, I don't know my calcs. Is there any chance that Spirit Break plus Behemoth Blade KO is? Probably not, right? Probs not. Basically, if I'm wrong, eh, we ball. Eh, no, we don't ball. Let's let's play it safe. I don't want to lose the game because I get the turn one wrong. Turn one wrong. Like I'm probably just gonna. Oh, they didn't go for trick room. That's fine. Uh, okay, if they didn't go for trick room. We're kind of chilling. Amogus? Sus? Among us, sus? Mojus? Among, 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 good, among us, among us. Am I appealing to the youth? Thanks very much, Kevin. Oh, that's the not good. That's bad. Getting lights screwed up is pretty big, though. Let's see what they go for here. They're probably just taking out Grim. Right? The thing is that they really want Trick Room up. Yeah, they're taking out Grim here. Getting a defense boost is not, not very fog of them. I died. Mm, if it's Life Orb, I don't think crit matter. If it's Life Orb, crit definitely didn't matter. Even with that Life Orb, I kind of think I die. Okay, um, it's not ideal. Oh, it's not Life Orb. Okay, it might have mattered. Um, I kind of just want to hit the Ghost Sauce. Let's just do it. I think last time my weakness was that I, I, I waited too long. Let's just hit the Go button. How did you not predict the Protect? The what? Don't you don't you backseat game me? There was the protect was not in the cards of that turn. They, they, they had two good moves there. They weren't in danger of being KO'd, so they were gonna either go. They, most of the time, they would either go either go rage powder, or they would go um, spore, and they did neither. And in both cases, Behemoth played to my best move. Actually, protect is actually better for me there. Because they because nothing fell asleep. Imagine that it just been spore and desation. Then I would really be in trouble. All right, let's go. I'm hitting the ghost sauce early. I think this part of the challenge is Nagirna. And here's the other nice thing is that I got light screen up first, so but my Alangar went down. Um, so the downside of that is of course that um, I don't get reflect up, but I am getting max steel spike boost, which is kind of the same thing at the end of the day. Okay. We really hope that the plus one behemoth blade plus steel spike KOs. I am genuinely not sure. Zation, you gotta do like 60 here, buddy. Cause if they go for max quake, I don't know if I'm KOing. And if I don't KO, then I'm just doomed. Crit. That's a lot of damage. Don't quake me. Wait, what am I saying? Of course they're gonna quake me. Oh, McGear, and I have a really bad feeling that you're a lot weaker than I've been giving you credit for. Wait, I should have starfalled. Uh, hang on a second. Wait, chat. I have a, if this doesn't KO, if this doesn't KO, it's plus one. It's a max move, right? It should KO, right? We're big. Oh, we are turbo chilling. Okay, McGear, to boost its defense. Cute, but more importantly, it boosted special attack. And you know what they say: once you boost your special attack, you can never special go back. Ah, Kroger. Now we have an important decision to make here, because if I'm them. I want to play rough here, right? That's the truth. Hang on. Four, where's my... 49 divided by 185. There's no way this kills through. 49 divided by 180... No. 49 divided by 185 is 26%, which means it's a, it's a pretty decent roll to fail with the next one. Ugh. Um, it's going to be really close if the next one KOs. I'm not willing to risk it. I'm going to go for play rough here because I believe that plus one McGearna can win this game. Especially once they all goes out of max. I missed. I'm so I'm I'm so I'm so bad. I missed. 
Okay, I think I lose now. Uh, if I hit that, I'm that was spout as well. So if I hit that, I'm 100% winning. Ugh, that feels so bad. I should have sacred. Oh, it's life orb. Huh. Okay. Plus one Kyogre. It's plus two, plus two. Uh, it's gonna be close, Chad. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think I ran out of steam by missing that. I really did. This is plus two versus plus one. Uh, uh, uh. Huh. Eh. Uh, uh, uh. Um, uh, um, uh, je suis les oeufs de la chienne rouge. Je m'appelle le monsieur, mais je, je, je ne sais pas. Je, je suis les oeufs de la chienne. Uh, please KO. It's plus two special defense, Diogo. So there's no way I get the KO, right? Yeah, I don't get the KO here, which is bad. Um, let's go for a little cheeky cow play. Oh, oh, oh monsieur. <sighs> Wait, is that okay? No, it's not okay, actually. Let's look over Trick Room. No, they went for a car. I'm out of juice. I'm totally out juiced. This does not do enough damage. Ugh, I'm totally out of juice. Okay, you know what the dumb thing is? I could still win this. That's the worst part about all of this. It totally depends on what their last Pokemon is because Yveltal can kind of solo everything. You know what I mean? That's the worst part is that I could win this. Uh, I think, right? I wish I had a defense boost in Yveltal. That would really help. God, if I just had a play rough, I'd be winning for sure. Take over Earth Power, okay. <clears throat> so it's now a two versus two. My Magirna is all set up, but my Magirna is on one HP. It's not going to survive another hit. Is that Calyrex? Okay. So basically what it comes down to here is, is this stupid Calyrex Focus Sash again? Because if it is... I'm in trouble. And if it's not, I can win. Because I have Yveltal with still a couple turns of light screen left, right? Three turns of light screen, and Diago won't have protect, most likely. So I guess, I, I mean, I only have one move here, right? It's foul play the, the Calyrex, and it's Dazzling Gleam. Okay, it all comes down to if this KOs. Yveltal? Oh, I was so close. That's literally... That's okay. Yeah. Okay, Calyrex are running Sash. That's un it's unfortunate I missed the play rough, but Sacred Sword would have done something similar in all honesty. So I, I don't know if I needed to gamble there is the truth. And I don't, n the crit may have mattered, honestly, since it was clearly not offensive Dialga. Um, but that's okay, live and learn. Um, I do think that the matchup was in my favor and I think I played it pretty well in all honesty. Um, especially given how troublesome Am Amoongus was, but um, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, can't win them all. Dialga is kind of difficult. In all honesty, but that is that is a little unfortunate, but I think it's okay. I, I think Sacred Sword was fine there in all honesty, because I expected Protect anyway. Okay, double dog. They got the dogs out. Um, Who are my strong Pokemon here? Zacian is good. Kyogre is great if I can get into position, but there's no guarantee I'll be able to get into position. Uh, Magirna is really my best Pokemon here, which is not ideal. There's a big part of me that just wants to go Zacian Kyogre lead, in all honesty. Um, okay, Zacian Kyogre is not actually that bad. I'm going to do Zacian Kyogre here. It's a little bit offensive and a little bit risky, and I don't... Uh, the thing is, if I do this, though... What's my goal? Certain victory? Can I do this and do late game Aleki? Yeah, okay. I think the thing is, once Groudon takes damage... If... Okay, here's my plan. If I can get rid of the Groudon, then I can sweep through with late game Aleki. That's my plan.
The Thumbs Edge is actually kind of hard for my team because I, um. We just don't want to see Rillaboom lead or Groudon. Eh. Le. Eh. Um. Oh, I, I see the vision. Oh, I see the vision. Um, does it work? Though? Uh, does it work? Not exactly, right? Ah, it works. Chat, I, I have one question for you. I have two questions for you. First, who's station activated those swords first? Because I wasn't watching. Second, do we ball? Do you think I'm afraid of a little sunlight? You think the harsh sunlight can scare me? I've got Reginald in the back. Please. Please, I've got Reginald in the back. Please don't make the right move here. Uh oh. Well, they're not Dynamaxing Zation. Chat, there's only one way that this can go, and it is quite badly. Je m'appelle les de la Chien Rouge. Ah, it's okay. We're being chilling. We got a lucky. Ah, uh, are we being chilling? Uh, do we ball? 80%. That's good chip. I'm down. That's good enough chip for me. Okay, high roll the Behemoth Blade and also crit it. Okay, it's fine. Good enough for me. That's enough damage. <clears throat> All right, now this turn is going to look really bad, okay? And I know that and just don't, please don't give up on me because it's going to look bad. Calculated, just plan for that. You guys think I didn't, I didn't, you think that wasn't part of the EVs that I obviously planned for? Chat, please, a little respect. Obviously, I calculated that. Duh. Obviously, I knew it was going to survive. I wasn't worried. I don't want to stay in a water spell. I'll tell you that much. I hope they don't have quick attack because if they do, bye bye. I want to, I need an adult. This could go really bad. I should have just sacked Kyogre. <laughs> Please don't kill me! <laughs> Please! <laughs> okay, it's a run. <laughs> issue is now it's plus two, which is really bad. And now all my Pokemon are at no HP left. I can't do anything. What do you want me to do? I can't do anything. Ele Electric doesn't KO anymore. But I have to take the KO, right? Or else I'm screwed. It's, I'm so, it's so doomed. I can't do anything. Um, I mean, I need to get a Max Lightning kick, right? All right, I have a vision. It's kind of, it's kind of sucks though. <laughs> All right, you know, Tall, you need to get this KO. I actually don't. It doesn't have much HP left, but it might be enough that this doesn't KO. Come on. Okay, I still am pretty sure that I lose this. Sorry, guys, I didn't. I didn't account for cost up very ground on. Basically, it comes down to who is it this targeted. Okay. Why is this the best player in the entire world? I'm Scarf Kyogre, so I didn't want to take the one. I didn't want to use one HP Water Spout. I figured it'd be better to just take out the Zacian and then, yeah, go into Yvalto. It seemed pretty safe to me, but I was wrong. And the issue is that now the Zacian is plus two special defense. Like, that's actually what's what's really bad here. It's plus two special defense. If they have anything that is not Rillaboom here, I have a decent shot, I think. Or if they have anything with priority. Zemazenta, okay. Bzabazadda. So what's the last Pokemon is my question. Because this thing, here's the thing. 
I have so much faith in Reginald. Honestly, I have, I have infinite faith in Reginald. Last Pokemon could be Kyogre, in which case Reginald's actually looking pretty decent. The question is, do I want to risk Wide Guard? And the answer is no. I'm not willing to risk Wide Guard here because if they Wide Guard, then I lose. So I'm just going to go for Thunder here because basically like if they make the right plays, I think I'm screwed regardless. We got the double dogs out. It's definitely not Rilla. Yeah, you're, you're actually right about that. If it were Rilla, then they would be kind of inting here. Bodyguard? That's even worse. That's actually the worst case scenario. I no longer have the health to win this. I could have read into that. I, I could have maybe gone. I, I think. I think Orin Pulse and Max Lightning was fine. Uh, nah. Okay, that's not good. Maybe they'll go for the. Maybe they'll use a weird move here. Dang, this person outplayed me every single. Ooh. Snarl. I can't win this game for. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. <clears throat> they really outplayed me every single turn. I mean, we just have to keep going for it, right? Basically, like, <clears throat> I can win with a crucial critical hit at the right time. That's kind of the only way out here, which is not super likely, in my opinion. This is frustrating because like my team isn't even like my team is way better than the last time. Ah, frustrating is a strong word, isn't it? It's not frustrating. I'm really thinking about it. I don't think I'm getting stream snipe. They're, they just I, I didn't make any crazy plays. I did, I mean I didn't expect custom berry grad on. Yeah, that plus two special events. It was the custom berry that really got me. <clears throat> Double dog. Double dog was too strong. Couldn't keep up. All right. Let's slow down. It doesn't really matter. You just need to go on a win streak. That's really how you get to rank one. Is you just need to go on. It's just like one good win streak. So losses aren't, aren't that big a deal in all honesty. Man, those wolves are strong. It's probably three wins to Ultra Ball and then another three wins to Master Ball. So I got to go on like a six win streak, which is kind of daunting actually, but it's all right. I got nothing but time, baby. Okay. <laughs> three and three is not amazing. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> it's not awful, though. If you're on for content, right? Listen, I'm there was no there is no universe in which I ever predict cussed at Barry Grout on there. Ever. Okay, let's see here. So when I look at this team, I think kind of similar to the last team in that Aleki looks super strong. Um, I want, okay, I want five of my Pokemon here. Yveldo looks pretty decent here if I get rid of the Zacian. Um, um the Whimsicott's what makes this tricky, but I'm not sure that they actually need to bring Whimsicott versus me, so I could just not cover for it, but that feels kind of like a mistake. Um, <clears throat> I really want Grimmsnarl here. Like, Grimmsnarl's good. Zacian, Ogre, Aleki, Yveltal. Wait, uh, that's not going to work. Um, I want Yveltal here for sure because it's so good into Calyrex, right? Yveltal is great. It's good in Ground and it's good in Calyrex. So Yveltal comes. I think I want Kyogre here because it's super strong. Um, I want it in the back. So it's Kyogre and Yveltal probably in the back, which means I get two up front. In that case, I definitely want Olongar. And then the Zacian is safer, I would say. It covers more leads and it also exerts more offensive pressure. Yeah, I'll do Zacian. An interesting background. Like green screen out. Whim station. Okay. I would say that's not ideal in all honesty, because they're gonna get speed control over me. 
It's not the end of the world, though. I just need to time my attacks correctly. Um, Whimsation. Okay, so the who do they have in the back? Probably Groudon, right? Groudon plus one. I could go for scary face here, which gives me speed control, but not defense support. Um, I think I want to go for reflect here. I want to go reflect and I want to go behind the blade into station. I'm not going to be able to get both screens up and that's just okay. I think that this is okay. And I also, I mean, I could have let a lucky, but it was just too volatile. Chat, I got bad news for me. Okay. Well, first of all, let's see which moves they've left me with. I have a bad feeling. Okay. No, I don't want that. Hey. Okay. I got Sacred Sword, baby. Okay. That's a problem. Um. I would love to set light screen up, but in all honesty, I really need this thing on. So I'm going to do this. Because uh, I no longer have a way through... Uh, okay, we're kind of okay, I guess. I have Reflect Up, which is awesome. And I got some damage on the Zacian, which is also good. The problem... Yeah, you know, there's a couple problems. Ah, uh, oh, shoot. Okay. So we know they don't have Sacred Sword. They've got Imprison. Okay, I'm faster. Honestly, respectable damage. Super respectable damage. I'm basically just trying to put myself in a position where Kyogre can do something good. But uh, that might be difficult. Uh, Kyogre, my beloved. You're going to have to super hard carry there. Here. Wherever. Okay, Kyogre. <laughs> if nobody else got me, <laughs> I know Kyogre got me. Um, That scary face is kind of influential. I could go for Origin Pulse here, which is a little safer. Or mm, I could go for Spout, which is way less safe. Or I could Max. I'm going to spout. I'm going to spout. They, they click their moves quickly. They're staying with Z. They're staying with Groudon. In a perfect world, they don't max Groudon here. This is not a perfect world. In a... If they're faster with their Groudon than my Kyogre, which is extremely likely, I think it's automatically over. Like, instantaneously over. Okay, now it's just doomed regardless. Okay. Pongers? Wide people glad, champ? Okay, well, we learned that their Groudon was faster than my Ogre. So now the question becomes, what do I do? <laughs> okay. Why don't we just... What do they have in the back, right? That's the question for the chat. Because I think just taking out the Zacian here is pretty tempting in all honesty, especially given... Yeah, I think I want to max over here. And the question is, do, who do I want to save here? I'm going to go into Zacian. Okay. Because they're not going to max Quake this slot, in all honesty, and with Reflect Up, Kyogre is decent enough. We know they're max Quaking the other slot. They have Tailwind Up, which is why they're faster. Ugh, this is going to be difficult, but not impossible. I have Scarf Kyogre and I've got a lot of damage on Groudon. If Zacian goes down here, and this is most likely into Kyogre, but if they read the switch, then good for them. They didn't read the switch, good for me. That's, so, that's through Reflect? That's through Reflect? Okay, Play Rough. I was like, it's either Play Rough or Behemoth Blade. I hope it's the one that I want. Uh, with plus one digital events, this still goes down. 
Okay. So we know Whimsicott in the back is not a threat to us. Groudon is on. It's okay. We got out of imprison. Finally. That just couldn't matter. Okay. It all comes down to what is that gosh darn last restricted Pokemon? Not gonna show it. Okay, that's fine. Um, here's the truth. I think that in this position, the I, like the ground on the sitting duck for next turn. I'm gonna try and take out the whims here. And I'm gonna switch back into Yveltal to try and catch a max quake. No, that doesn't Yeah. We don't know the item on Groudon, right? Should I just go into Geyser into Groudon and then switch to Yveltal? Is there really any downside to that? Because if Groudon goes down. Okay, I'm gonna do this because because Whimsicott's not really a threat in the long run, and if I can force them into their last Pokemon, I can it's potentially attack it with Kyogre's last turn of Dynamax. Okay, they stayed in with both. Cat, you I know you're smart. You have much better things to talk about than hacked Pokemon or something you can't know. Tailwind went down? I wasn't paying attention. Hey. Yeah, that's all, my friend. Hey, I'm walking here. All right, I got a couple turns to get through this freaking Tailwind. Thanks very much, Rad School. I appreciate that. What accent is that? I honestly cycle, like, cycle through accents so often, I have no idea. I couldn't tell you if I wanted to, and I don't want to. Okay, nice flare from them, but they're out of max now. Okay. Um Hailstorm here and Oblivion Wing. Fills me back up to get rid of the ground and like should KO both Pokemon, putting me in potentially a three versus one. And if their last Pokemon is Kyogre, it's not really relevant. Um I have reflect up, so unless this is like Stone Edge. Blades, that's fine. Kyogre's health is not the important thing. We're trying to win this game with Evel Tall, is the truth. Okay. okay. That's really bad. I needed that on the field for one more turn. And the worst part is it's probably I've been playing this whole game like it's Kyogre's last and it's got to be Kyogre and I am one turn four here. Oh, I'm so close. Damn. Oh, man, that's unfortunate. Okay. Yeah, that was through reflect. Okay. Can I still win this? Probably not, right? I don't have light screen up. All right, let's do this. Out. Zation will live this is the thing. Zation will survive. Zation will survive this. So the question is, did they go for Precipice Blades? They went for Stone Edge? I call... I was like, it's going to crit. Okay. And this chat is a guaranteed win condition watch this behemoth blade here i didn't go for player up because i learned from my mistakes i didn't want to potentially miss and lose the game on it so now groudon goes down tailwind were up two turns ago this is the third turn of tailwind they have one turn of tailwind remaining and what that means is that my the reason i've saved zation to the end here is that zation has protect so what i can do is i can go protect can't do anything about that and i can go for sucker punch here and if they want to get rid of the hole They have to attack. So, Sucker Punch comes out. Kyogre is down very low. They go for Spout again. If this is Scarf Kyogre, I might have a problem. Unless this, this shouldn't. Spout Kyogre. Or, yeah, Scarf. Yeah, okay. And that's game. And there's no counterplay. That was through a crit. Okay, they really wanted to crit. And that is how, and we go for the 100% accurate move here, just in case. 
And that's how you turn around a game that was looking pretty bad between the Imprisonization, the Groudon Crit. Yeah, that wasn't looking good. I'll tell you the truth. That one was looking pretty bad. But hey, you know what they say? Is the right button? World champ different. World champ. World champ different. World champ different. Like spaghetti? Yeah. Who doesn't like spaghetti? Okay, fine. That was good. Let's keep that up. Because the thing is that you can't always control how you, um, if you get good or bad luck, but you can control how you play, right? And so I saw, I saw an out there, which is that my opponent needed to not cover for the, if, if my opponent didn't cover for the sucker punch and instead attacked into Yvel Tol with Groudon, which makes a lot of sense in my opinion. Wait, doesn't I just, ugh, didn't I just, wait, these are the exact same six Pokemon I just played, right? Let's try this order this time. How about that, chat? This could go badly, but I think it's all right. Congrats on joining Beast Coast. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. you seem a long ways away from number one. Yeah, but it creeps up on you. I just had to, I just had to get a little warmed up. You know what I mean? Just got a little, got a little movement in the chat. I can see my live viewers. Is there a reason I'm putting my battery to do this? How do I do it? 200 is it? 634. Nice. Figure it out. Charger bug. Same team, right? Obviously, it's not the same. How does it feel like for Xerneas to not be meta? Great. I, I hate Xerneas. Keep him on. Whimsicott Groudon. Okay, this lead is far, far, far more in my favor. Um, if it's the same team. Okay, so I like I want to get damage on Groudon with foul play, but the truth is that really the most my Dynamax in this game. I think the best thing I can do, in all honesty, is just go after the Whimsicott, because if it doesn't have Focus Sash again. Which is, I think, pretty likely given that there's a power in the team. Um, if it doesn't have Focus Sash again, then. Like, getting rid of. Like, being able to just stall through these turns of Tailwind and then be done with Tailwind. Like, be able to win with Kyogre in the late game is super valuable. And, like, if they. What are they gonna do? Stone Edge me? They're not gonna crit, right? If they don't crit, I'm just gonna heal off the damage entirely. Oh. Okay, that's big damage. Oh no, my Yveltal took damage. And his speed got dropped. Wah, 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 wah. That's what you sound like, you Tall. I mean, no, that's what you sound like, Groudon player. Die. They get a free switch in. It's not ideal, of course, but it's not the worst thing that's ever happened to me. I get both screens up. I can max Yveltal if they go into Kyogre. If they go into Zacian, I'll just go for a foul play. It's funny because foul, you know, foul play, but it's like Yveltal's a bird, so it's like foul play. You know what I mean? What is that? Oh! Um, I need to get through these next two turns of Tailwind somehow. Mm. It's really not worth setting Light Screen up, in my opinion. I think I'd rather go for Speed Control. Let's go for a Scary Face here and a Foul Play here, I think. Uh, who do I want a Foul Play here? Like, the damage on Zacian is probably more impactful. We're going to go here. Okay, no max. Smarter than to conserve it, in my opinion. They miss, they hit. Match. Yeah, that was a good play. Um, I could have air streamed. Nah, no, airstream wouldn't have done anything. They're probably going after Grim, right? The Grim Reaper. Yeah, good play. Um, in all honesty, I. I'm in a kind of an interesting spot here, right? Where I got some good damage on Zacian with this foul play. This foul play is really important because it puts Zacian in uh, range of attacks later. Also, it just does infinite damage. Um, 
I mean, Mineization could still... Basically, the problem is that there's two turns left with Tailwind, right? Tailwind and Obsession came in, Grimstar went down. This is turn three. I kind of just want to pull the trigger now, in all honesty. Right? Get whatever damage down that I can. Um. Yeah, why not? Why not, right? Let's just go for Max Geyser, force them to make a play to counter it. Um, they probably have to max Groudon if they want to do something about it. <clears throat> I maybe should have set Light Screen up, but I think the pressure from Scary Face is worth it, in all honesty. Because here's the situation right now, right? They can take out my Yveltal, yes. Um, oh, I actually, I may have made a mistake. Because if you also go, yeah, I think I actually made a mistake here. I think I'm overestimating Reflect. Because if they like max Rockfall, they they either didn't max or they or I made a mistake by maxing. Um, I don't think Yveltal takes player off, right? I think I'm also overestimating Yveltal's bulk here. Let's see here. He blade into. Miss, miss, miss. I'm so cracked. Player up. Okay, I thought I would live this, but in hindsight, there's no way, right? Yeah, I was wrong. I was so wrong. I'm so invalid. Okay, but I didn't really have a better move there. It's not like I could have switched into Zacian. So I think in the end, this actually ends up being correct. The problem is, who is the last Pokemon? You know what I mean? This is a close one. Um, I feel like the momentum is in my favor. I feel like the, the positioning is in my favor. Oh, Yveltal, you dare show your face over here, huh? After what you said, huh? Yveltal, really? You think you're so tough? Um, I'm like worried about really niche situations right now. Um, I'm worried about imprison again is the truth. <laughs> I'm worried about imprison. I'm worried about Max Flare Yveltal. Um, let's see here. What do I want to do? Let's, let's, this is a really crucial turn. Let's take the time to think about it. I think it's worth max geysering here in all honesty because I think it's the right move. Um, <clears throat> basically, if Zacian were to attack and I were to do, like, let's say I were to hard read to protect here, that was the wrong move. There was no reason to protect my, my Zacian here. I should have max geysered into the Yveltal and Behemoth Blade into the Zacian. That was because I forgot about. No, 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 I'm right, I'm right, because they still have 10 up. Never mind, I'm right. Um, here comes the max. That was the right move. I got my sorry, I got my speed tears confused for a second, but I think this is correct. Basically, Yveltal sometimes will run Heat Wave Life Orb, and that could be a little problematic. And would also like that would basically keep their Zation alive. Okay, my Zation uses protect. That's to be expected. The question is, what is their Zation doing? Darkness. Okay. Into Kyogre. Okay. That's two games to crits. Pause, champ. No way. No way.
Okay, the correct play here is protect. I'm pretty sure. It's protect and the miss player from lose. Uh, it's, I'm probably gonna lose on a player I've missed. That's my prediction. Chair stream. This is still the correct play for me. Oh, this is. Ah. Oh. It's it it's they can basically they have two outs. It's player of miss or dark pulse flinch. It's player of miss or dark dark pulse flinch, and I don't have a better move. Uh, Behemoth play doesn't KO, unfortunately. All right, Zation. You go, if nobody else got me, I know Zation got me. Okay, I mean, I have no idea if it's physical or special, right? It could be heat or heat wave might just went out right, but I. Oh no! Oh nuts! Heat wave will definitely KO me from this range. I mean, I, I don't have a better move here. I didn't have any better moves because this <sighs> on a crit. Okay. Oh, that sucks but you know what here's the thing chat here's the thing yeah I lost on a oh it was a special attack crit it did so much damage even with okay well here's the thing hmm. was it ever worth going the human play didn't really have a chance to KO it, well I made I don't disagree with my play there the thing is that what cost me there was actually setting not setting up light screen that was the issue right I mean I went for scary face did scary face actually make any difference at all oh noe um you know what it's make your in a time baby scary face didn't actually end up making a difference at all and if I'd set light screen up I, I wouldn't have been in that end, end game position right so that was that was my bad I think it's important even when you get unlucky to look back and think like what could you have done differently and like there's a very clear to me there's a very clear example in that game and that is could have simply been better could have simply played self-life screen drift blim eternatus what is going on in the house of commons okay this to me looks like some weirdo hell and stuff and i don't like that i want the drift limb gone but i also don't want turn to just run away with this game what do they have in the back mew it's not really worth maxing my lucky here because i'll just get ko they have zation mew let's just do this electro web and then behemoth blade does this ko probably not um who do i have in the back ivy veltal and mcgearna and why don't oopsie why don't we just go why don't we just make sure tailwind doesn't go up i think that's actually more valuable to me in the long run in all honesty okay hit both you know this could actually backfire depending on the item but surely they're like sash or something right surely they're not like citrus berry uh oh unburden the uh, minus one zation okay I really spooked myself. <laughs> Do you really release your world theme? Uh, we are like four weeks into working on the world's video. It's going to be the it's going to be the highest quality video on my channel. Oh, I lived. That kills. What? That kills. It specs. It's it specs. It specs. Ugh um well that's spooky uh other mons are what it's like oh they have a zation yeah Le. what are we going to here uh lapras zation tepufini should we just bet on all magirna nah probably a mistake okay Feeny comes in in that spot what the heck okay um the truth of the matter is I kind of just want to hit the ghost sauce it's minus one it turned this so I'm faster than it with the adults all I just want to hit the ghost sauce I don't know what to tell you I, I want to click go button and again what if it's like icy wind type of me or something that'd be bad right no uh, then they wouldn't have a, they wouldn't have a maximum at that point let's just 
I mean, they're locked into Specs Flame Terror. Who cares? I'm just gonna go for this, and I guess Dark Pulse is probably my best move. Good damage. Big flinch. Mm, not good. I don't think that oh man I made the wrong play the turn um uh uh oh oh it's what am I saying it's specs a turn it's got to be specs a turn in this right so let's just let's just do this I'll just flinch again You better max Feeny here, because otherwise Reginald is taking a big old snack. And if I'm wrong about the specs here, I am so messed up here. Like, okay. Well, I don't understand what's going on in this game, but it's fine. I don't care how many calm eyes you have. This is a Reginald. Thank you for the bits. Uh... Thank you very much. All right, Givelto. If nobody else is, if nobody's got me, if, if, if I, if there's one, you know, Givelto's probably got me. I didn't think that was gonna kill. I didn't, I didn't believe it. I didn't. I, there was no part of me that believed that it was gonna KO. All right, cool. Oh, take a deep breath. We want to start a win streak now because there's nothing in the back that can handle Reginald. Yeah, this is an interesting game. They, um... I, I don't understand what they were thinking with the Dynamax, but maybe their turn one just didn't go the way they expected and they planned on maxing Driftlim or something. Gee. All right, cool. Let's start a win streak here. Basically, the way the ladder works is that, like, if you lose, you lose a little bit of points. If you win one game in a row, you gain a little bit of points. But if you win two games in a row, that's when you actually gain. Like, basically, winning consecutive games gives you actual, like, big jumps. So, like, you'll notice I've kind of been stagnant for a while. Like, up and down, basically going the same, like, going up and down the same amount. The English way of saying that, I think. But if I were to win, I would go up like another, like, I would basically go up almost half of the remaining bar. Probably exactly half the remaining bar. TikTok viewers, you got any questions for me? How you doing? Mind explaining why Gen 9 is going to be so huge for Pokemon? It's kind of a long answer, but the basic answer is that, um... The basic reason is that the way that Pokemon content has always worked on YouTube and on Twitch, but I, I'll speak for YouTube because that's the only one I'm, I know for sure. Let's talk about YouTube, okay? Is that um, every three years, a new game comes out. Um, give me one second. Okay, every three years, almost a third of a decade passes. Um... Um, okay, so every three years, a new generation comes out. And um, basically, the way that it works is that when that new generation comes out, interest in Pokemon spikes. Shoots way, way, way up, right? Tons of new people. We're talking factors of like 10 times, if not more, for pretty much across the board. From there... From there, it's a pretty steep decline. So... November, December, it's super high. January, you start to see the decline. And by February, you're declining fast. And, and then what happens is you hit a new plateau, um, which is higher than the old plateau, but still much lower than the peak. So why do we care about this? Well, the reason why I think that this is interesting um, is because that is how it's always worked. That is how it worked in X and Y. That is how it worked in Sun and Moon. And that's also how it worked in Sword and Shield. So 
huge new exponential growth sharp decline new normal and over time pokemon has been growing which is awesome um however here's what's interesting right now on youtube should be the most dead that pokemon content has ever been by a long shot right there has been no new game in a while legend rcs was not like a real mainline game bdsp had no real connectivity with uh sword and shield it was kind of just like a remake it wasn't like really interactive in the same way um it wasn't like ores or it wasn't like ores or anything i should have protected I, I had a feeling i should uh there um and yet Despite that, um, Pokemon content on YouTube right now is doing the best that it ever has been by a long shot. Um, like it's not close. And, and we're talking, including comparing Pokemon content right now to like big releases and stuff like the big, like the big moments from, um, from the prior games. So this, this time right now where it should be the most dead that it ever has been ever Pokemon content is doing the best that it ever has been. So why is that? Well, I think in large part, it's because people figured out how to make good. This person is really tilting me. Let me get your Kyurem. Hey, take out Thunder Wave. Hey, tears. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's stuff like, I mean, I think honestly, like what John and Jack have done, sorry, PM seven and, um, purple cliff have done is a big factor in that. Um, you also have more general creators like uh small ant um alpha rat it's uh jaden also is a big factor in this but basically people have been figuring out how to make good pokemon content back in the day and I'm, I'm super guilty of this i'm guilty of this maybe more than anyone else like the content that people would make was so niche like it was so targeted to people who are already watching pokemon content and um press f if you think i'm gonna press press one if you think i'm about to get full paralyzed here just by covering for this um it was so niche and so basically because of that the the viewership was really niche and so people have figured out wait a second like pokemon is the biggest oh wow media franchise in the world it is the single biggest media franchise in the world people know about pokemon people love pokemon like we can make videos that are actually like approachable to like the casual viewer um and so because of that pokemon content has really not only seen a spike in viewership but seen a spike in quality which is a really big deal and so when you consider that right now the content is doing better than it ever has been at any point previously in this entire life cycle right and on top of that um people have figured out how to make actual good pokemon videos i think that the conditions are right basically i need damage on this thing is the truth i think the, i think basically like when you consider the exponential effect combined with the uh oh with the current um highest viewership ever i think it's gonna be huge cali rex not so nice i just know i'm about to lose this one on uh on on full para i can feel it <laughs> i can still win this question mark oh they're fat max speed oh they boomed me they super boomed me okay what moves do i have access to do i have protect can't use protect or sacred sword Okay, do I play rough? They, they left me with only freaking. Okay. All right. You want to play? Let's play, baby. <laughs> you want to take KOs? I'll. You want KOs? I'll give you KOs. <laughs> but please don't hit me with a ground move because that'd be really unfortunate. This is looking pretty bad. Imprisonation with max speed is not uh, not very poggers, as the as the youth say. Hmm, this is reverse pog, pog champ. If they max quake me here, I'm going turbo omega smoge. Eighth. Ah, if they max quake me, ah, this is so risky. Like basically if it's a hailstorm, I'm fine. But if it's quake, oh man, it's probably quake, right? If it's hailstorm, I might be okay. If it's quake, I'm not okay at all. I'm so close. <laughs> Behemoth Blade should be into um, Grimmsnarl is my guess. They predicted me. I can't believe they predicted me there. Okay, they partially predicted me. Hmm. Olangar. Why are you doing this to me, Olangar? I mean, uh, does anyone see a way out of this? I see a way out of this. Ooh, pick me, pick me. Okay, um... 189 um i mean it's gotta just be like this right 
Wait, Steel Spike scary face? No. Yeah? No. Yeah? I gotta do this. It's the only way out. I don't think it works, but it's the only way out. <clears throat> Even Dynamaxing both my mods wouldn't really help me here. So I get some damage on here and I get the defense boost. Basically, my hope is that at some point I can. If I had just gotten away through, the, if I just found a way through this station, like I would have been okay, I think. The issue is that I did not find a way through the station. Spoilers. I need McGearn to make it through this turn, which I think it should, thanks to this defense boost. Thanks to the scary face. Thanks to my expert foresight and analysis. Thanks to my brain. I live this, unless they crit, which I know this has been going. Okay, I'm still alive, but I am barely breathing. Hellstorm comes out into a Longar. Rather than going for a special defense boost, I can't think. Oh, you want to see the moves? Hang on, I can make myself smaller. Sorry. I thought you wanted to see my nice big face. You should have an easier time now. That's a little small. How about that? All right, I'm plus one Magear now. Chat. Do you love me? Chat, I have an idea. Perhaps foolish, perhaps unwise. But you know what? I've never been one to shy away from taking risks. So why don't we just say, I just want to take a moment and say, the outcome is uncertain, right? We don't know what's going to happen. But regardless of what happens this turn and what the outcome of this battle is, I want to say thanks for being here and thanks for being a part of the journey because I don't know if the journey is going to be smooth bye bye really Thunderwave fake out what? Thunderwave and fake out and what? Hmm, huh? I have a really bad I like feeling I know what they're gonna do here. I think they're gonna thunderwave my I'm pretty sure they're just gonna thunderwave my Magirna. <laughs> fake out, okay. So what are they doing with this? Because I don't think McGearn is going down. It's there. It's bad. They always have the perfect item. <laughs> that being said, this is still winnable. I fully believe that. That's a ton of damage. Honestly, it all comes down to this turn. This is the crucial turn. I don't think my Pokemon... It depends. Uh, McGearn is probably getting KO'd here. I forgot about the attack boost. Oh, I forgot about the attack boost. I'm gonna lose on full para. That's how this ends. That's actually, I've seen this movie. This is how that ends. This is how that, this is how this, that, that's how this ends. I've actually seen this movie. There goes my light screen. I lose on full para here. That's the, that's the, that's the final. <laughs> that's the final uh, act of this, of the story. All right, Zation. Last turn of hail. I mean, it's, it's, um, wait. Do I even win if I get this right? I still lose, right? Oh, I lose regardless. Hang on. I have to actually make a play here. Cause I, if I take a KO this turn, I definitely lose. Um, so I have to, I have to make a hard read. Because I need to, I need them to protect Calyrex, basically. They have to protect Calyrex here, I think. 
Okay. <sighs> My special attack doesn't matter, so it's okay if I get dropped by Spirit Break. And thanks to Reflect and the healing from this, which isn't a ton, but thanks to the defense boost and Reflect, I don't think I go down to Spirit Break. Basically, if I take the KO, the comes in and I just lose. Goblet comes out, but it should be okay with Reflect Defense. Okay, that's fine. Okay, right now what we're going to do is we're going to cover for a double protect. Because if they get the double protect, I lose regardless, right? So I have to go because basically if Zacian is the field before Calyrex is down, um, or, or like if Zacian and Calyrex are on the field at the same time, I always lose. So I double here to ensure that like, hmm, to hope that it's okay. I need to take these both in the same turn, basically. If I, and I lose on full pair. They go for the double. They don't get it. Zation, come on, buddy. Come on. Don't get full parried. Please don't get full parried. Okay, I have a 75% chance to win this. <laughs> Zation, my beloved. Yeah, I got the critical hit. All right, chat. Tell me right now, which move on Zacian has the highest chance of not getting full parrot? I think we can go for either Sacred Sword or Behemoth Blade. What do you think? How much health do they add? I hit them with what? I mean, both moves will kill. Press one if you want me to use Sacred Sword, plus two if you want me to use Behemoth Blade. Zacian. Oh, sorry. I have to actually look. Sorry. Chat. One, one, two, two. Oh, it's a tough one. Close. One. One, one. People want Sacred Sword, all right? Sacred Sword? Foul play. <clears throat> Yveltalization. Why don't you bring us home? Reflect and Sacred Sword means... All right, Zacian. It's all up to you. It's all up to you, buddy. I killed, right? Oh man, that was a close one. That was way too close for comfort. Ooh. That was way too close for comfort. That was way too close. I'm not gonna lie. That was way, way, way too close. And ultimately wasn't in my control, but the odds were in my favor, I think. Wolf, well, are you gay? No. <laughs> Thanks for asking though. Um, sometimes people just assume. Okay. Double shy for ch chat. Uh, what do you want me to do? It's they, they got the they got the they got the, they got the double dogs, okay? Alright, let's take a look here. Um, I really like Aleki here. I really like um who else do I really like? Uh, I really like Aleki here. Can I pair Lucky with anything? Not really, right? I mean, this looks pretty strong in all honesty. They're probably going to lead with like Palky or something, right? In all honesty, I kind of want to just do... Wait, hang on. I have an idea. Wait, wait, wait. Does this work? No Kyogre. Yep, 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 yep. Um, uh, I've seen variants of this with like... Hmm... Kind of scary. Yeah, whatever. We ball. Do we ball, chat? Uh, they're not going to leave like Zamazenta plus Ho, -Oh, right? There's no way. Not into this team. So maybe I could do. I want to bring Magirna here, but I don't think I should. Let's do a Lucky Yveltal, Ogre, and. I got to I will bring Magirna, but in the back. In the back. In the back, champ. Yeah, that's fine. I think your stream is lagging a bit. Like, what kind of lagging? Thanks very much, Victor. I really appreciate that. I'm not on Twitch. Uh, I'm on YouTube, though, right now. 
Honky has Amazenta. Okay. Interesting. Um. Interesting. Um. In all honesty, Amazenta is kind of. Other all honesty. How devastating is Trick Room going up? Like, I'm thinking, I'm worried I'm just gonna get like snarled here or something. Um. I really just want to go for max lightning and take KO. This is the truth. But I, this is really tricky because the, the path forward isn't clear. Palkia is one of the most dangerous Pokemon that they have. Um, I think I'm just gonna. Oh, wait, I need I need almost Endagon for sure. But I kind of want to max. I kind of want to max my Magearna here. Question mark. I have faith in Reginald. And I do need damage. Um. If this backfires, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be having a bad time. That's Groudon for sure. Ugh, okay. Not good. There goes my max. Oh, they got me. They super got me. I hate play. Zamasen does actually really hard for my team. Oh, that's rough. I should have protected. I couldn't have protected there in all honesty. It was too risky. What are they going for? Snarl? Oh, God dang. Okay. That's really bad. Um, maybe a crit will come out. Okay, if Groudon goes down, I mean, we're still in bad shape if Groudon goes down, but we might be able to do okay. Oh, that did not very much damage, did it? Let's go for a cheeky max guard here and foul play. Fine. Basically, we're going to be aiming for Yveltal taking out Groudon while Lucky puts Amazenta in two shot range. Because I should want to go for Prestos Blades here since Lucky is my max. I think Foul Play should do enough to two shot from this range. Easily. They go for Rock Tomb, but they miss. That's super huge. That was a really lucky miss. Go for this and this. Okay, we also need Electric Train up here, which, like, although not the most influential thing, is not horrible either. The issue is my back Pokemon. Okay, they're going to give me Foul Play damage on something, which is actually a pretty big deal. That's actually a huge deal. This Foul Play damage can do, like, it's going to do significant damage. And we know all the Mons now as well, which is super good. Um... Huge damage on Zamazenta, that's great. I am gonna end up at minus two though. Eh, which is not ideal. Okay, I know all the mon I know that Palkia is the Dynamax Pokemon, which means frankly my wait a second, electric train's up. Um uh um All my attackers are special, which is really bad. I gotta remember to bring Zacian versus Zamazenta next time. That was a mistake on my part. All their Pokemon are weak to Zacian, which is funny. Um Sorry, I know I'm saying, I'm saying I'm a lot, but I'm really busy. Uh... I'm gonna do this. Ah, bad play by me. Super bad play by me. Oh my God, I could have just killed the Zacian. I gave them way too much credit. I had, I had two easy ways of killing the Zacian. I gave them way too much credit. I don't reflect up or anything either. Ugh. Lives, but if they go for a damaging move here. Oh, that's not ideal, is it? <laughs> Such a funny animation. <laughs> this is my one good Pokemon answer to their strong guys. Oh, never mind. They just died. Thanks, coaching. Critical hit there is actually really bad if anyone's curious, but it is what it is, as the youth say. Okay, um, let's see here. They have to go into Plakia here, right? It's not like Ground, I couldn't do them anything. Okay, so it's Plakia, Zacian. Sorry, Plakia, Zamazenta, Unt. Plakia, Zamazenta, Unt, um, Unt, uh, Unt, uh, Plakia, Zamazenta, Unt. Well done. They got me. 
Oh, they absolutely just boomed me. Okay, I've got Yveltal still, which is fine. This is probably AB ground on based on the damage. Okay, honestly, getting a speed drop on the Palkia is kind of nice. I'm not even going to lie to you. Here comes the Palkia. That was a great switch. Honestly. I mean, they're giving me boosts. You know what they say? If a girl gives you boosts, she must really like you. I don't think anyone says that, Wolf. I'm just trying to get McGearness and boosts. Okay, that's all. I'm a simple guy. I want my... Please don't miss this. Please don't miss this, Reginald. Oh, you're so Omega Turbo Ultra Cracked. Please go for Spatial Rend, question mark. Dragon, 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 dragon. Not quick, not quick, not quick. Uh, it's not the end of the world. Not ideal, is it? Not the end of the world, is it? Okay. Okay. Okay, plus one. What's the situation? Minus one speed Palkia. New ground can't protect itself. Ooh, it's life orb. Ugh. Uh, the win condition here is... What? I'm going into Yveltal here because I don't want to give them range just yet. Dan, thanks very much for the $5. Um, Tim Leader, any region? What region type would you pick? I don't know, but water seems good. And that's a spoiler for something. That's not going to make sense to most, most of you for the next for another four months. Um, I think I just foul plan Dazzling Beam here, right? Palkia has two turns of max left. I have Kyogre in the back. Okay. Plus two. The question is, who's faster? Minus one Palkia or Magirna? Magirna, baby! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you make me laugh. Okay, let's snarl coaching behemoth bash wide guard. I don't think this thing has protect. So what I'm willing to do then is, uh, I think I have a pretty good move here, which is sucker punch. I honestly don't believe that'll KO, but I think I should go for it anyway. Um, that was kind of a mistake. Okay. Whew. Okay. Well, that's a three win streak finally. Okay, cool. That probably gets us into Ultra Ball. Okay, finally. <laughs> Two hours later. <laughs> that was a close one. Zamazenta, like, it's. I, okay, I, I don't think Zamazenta is a good Pokemon, but it's kind of hard for me to deal with, is the truth. <sighs> Interesting. Okay. Among Us is pretty spooky. My Yveltal looks really good here, except for the Zacian. So I think one of the ways... Okay, I'm going to do something a little weird. I'm going to leave Kyogre and Zacian here. And my thought process is basically that once I get rid of their Zacian, my Yveltal looks super strong, right? Um. And if they lead Kyogre plus Whimsicott, I'm going to start saying some bad words. Um... Other things that I can do here, Magirna is obviously an option, especially because like I don't need to Dynamax Kyogre here. I actually, I like Grimmsnarl here. I don't love it in the back, so it's probably Magirna or Alecky, right? I'm gonna do Alecky. I love Alecky. He's my friend. You talk so fast. Sorry. Of course I have it. <clears throat> Noob legendary users. <laughs> TikTok, you he caused me so much pain. <laughs> You're a gym leader in Adro's game, aren't you? If I am, it's the first that I'm hearing about it. Hell yeah, that much. Oh, that was a problem. I just no one's told me. Um. Okay, cool. The problem here, ah, this is bad actually. <laughs> okay. I have a Reginald in the back, right? I think, I think. So here's the problem is that if they have Kyogre in the back, I'm just gonna get blown up. I, I think I'm gonna trust my instinct and say, just hit the go. I, I think it's time to hit the ghost sauce. 
because basically here like okay like what i want to do is origin pulse behemoth blade take out the zation but the issue is that i'm just gonna run out of steam because kyogre comes in i've got no way to deal with water spout if they play off for behemoth blade my kyogre I take infinite damage you know what i mean like i think that in this position i'd rather just go for max force them to either let my zation keep its full hp or alternatively like kyogre is full hp and is still in max you over tailwind like so this means i get zation which is the number one threat in the team i don't need to max a lucky like yeah i was planning on it but I lose probably <laughs> okay i didn't expect that uh, this is probably not stash with my instinct i have my inst okay this is just not my day is it uh okay can i win this most likely not right i take out zation whimsicott's down to stash the issue is that now their kyogre comes in and things are going uh south Because they just go into uh, Kyogre, click Helping Hand, Water Spout in this game. Unless it's Calyrex. I, I didn't think it was Calyrex, but I decided to, like, I can manifest it, maybe. Um, they're just going to spout me, and I can't do anything about it. I have to protect Zation here. I, I see a way out, but it's not pretty. Yeah. Ah! Wait a second. Holy... S hold on a second. Three turns? Can I get through three turns? Probably not, right? Three turns? Can I get through three turns? It depends on what they go for this turn. They just go, uh, no, it doesn't matter that much if they go for this turn, right? Hmm. I need them to geyser here, is the truth. They didn't go for helping hand. They went for moonblast. It's fine. I live one more. Geyser? I don't think that should be into my ogre, right? Okay, take that decently well. Okay. Um. I can take one more moon blast. So, with that in mind, how many turns of that one are left? Pretty sus. And last Pokemon. <sighs> I should love this. So I'm sacrificing Zation here, but it is very worth it here. I may also be sacrificing Kyogre, which is a little bit less worth it. Wait, 15 times 17. No, I live. I live. I live. Trust, bro. I live this. A chip damage actually ends up being a little influential potentially. Um. Because now, okay, Whimsicott goes down. That's poggers. Um, I, my Kyogre survives, barely. So I've got a position. Here's the position. Electric terrain is up. I need to go into Evaltal here. That's the position. And my Dynamax ends. Evaltal comes in. Oh, there is a way I can lose this, unfortunately. Um, and it's that a lucky gets a one shot by sucker punch. <laughs> uh, my Dynamax is over though, which is cute and nice. And we like that because now there's a, uh, there's an, uh, uh, uh. Oh, I don't have a, oh, wait, uh, I didn't lock into anything, right? I'm a salt vest. I shouldn't die to like, um, anything looks spooky snarl is fine that's so fine because the goal here is not to win with um the goal is just to get you all to survive for the turn because the the secret here is that i set up electric train which allows huh oh no oh it's fine uh i don't die to that 
sometimes I say things confidently and the truth is I have not even a slight like an inkling sometimes I say things and I'm like sounds right and I truly have not not a clue in the world okay well it's snarl throat spray of Yveltal so let's here's where we use some inference okay Yveltal most likely we know it has snarl we also can infer that it probably has oblivion wing right if you were a snarl throat spray my hunch is that you do not want you do not want to run sucker punch because you want snarl you want oblivion wing and you have to have a special dark move that's dark pulse your last move being sucker punch instead of something like protect is not happening which means this Yveltal cannot protect itself and because we know that we know sorry this Yveltal cannot sucker punch which means that I what does it mean if I would knew my calcs better, I could probably make a better play than this. Like, there's probably a safe rising voltage plus foul play play here. But I'm going to go for Electro Web and Sucker Punch because I think that it KOs both. I know it KOs Ogre. That's why that, that chip from earlier kind of matters. So they don't go for Sucker Punch first, which is great. I guess this is only 95% accurate, but I'm going to hit both. I really thought I missed there. Whew. I was close and kind of messy. Whew, that was close. That was really close in all honesty. I'm pretty sure I had a safer end game. Eh, whatever. Let's see if I was right. So my guess is it to protect Dark Pulse, Snarl, and Oblivion Wing. Well, I've been wrong before, but Heat Wave wasn't changing anything there. It didn't have Sucker Punch is the important thing. Are you live anywhere else? Yes, I'm live on YouTube right now. YouTube.com slash WolfyVGC. And if you're watching on YouTube, we're also on TikTok. Okay. Oh, man. Is that is that Korean? Chrysel I haven't seen Cresselia in a long time. Okay. So when I look at this, I think Yveltal looks very strong. I think Zacian looks kind of scary. I think Reflect looks super strong because three of them on. Uh, Reflect is really strong here, but there's a catch. Um, once Kyogre also looks really good here. So once I get damage on the Zacian, my, I think that these four mons are correct, right? Yeah, because if I get, I need, I really want Reflect though because it just makes my Yveltal so hard for this team to deal with. And I just need damage on the Zacian, right? Zacian, Zacian, Zacian. And this is good because basically, so this is like, maybe this is a little bit too like uh, much explaining, but basically why I like this lead is because they only have, oh, never mind, I'm dumb. Um, I was going to say, they, like, normally the way that these teams would get rid of Grimmsnarl before it really starts to be annoying is um, they would use Zacian, but by leading Zacian, they, they allow me to hit with Behemoth Blade, which then lets me get into a position later where Grimmsnarl plus Kyogre can be really strong. Um... But they also have Solgaleo, which is why that was uh, not good. Um, that's really bad. Uh, that was really bad. Ugh. Um, I'm fine. What are you guys worrying about? Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Uh, I'm just going to call the, the obvious move here, which is Bulldoze. It's probably Max, Sogaleo, Boulders with the horse. Mm, I've been wrong before. I've been wrong before. I'm just going to say it. Uh, that's all right. Can't win them all. That's a lot of damage. They crit me. It didn't matter. Unless this is... You trying to tell me something, game? What? Okay. Um. I see an opportunity here. Do I want to take it? Like, okay, I kind of just want to. I kind of just want to foul play here. Or just switch out. Do they have Groudon? They do have Groudon, right? <sighs> Yveltal is my best max, is the problem. Basically.
Ah, I see something really cool that I could do. But it could easily backfire. Let's just go for foul play. Let's get both my screens up and get a foul play down. Let's not rush this. Basically, if I can get Eveltal speed boost before Kyogre is the field, I can use... He stayed in? Wait, what? I'm so confused. I shouldn't die to this. I've never been wrong in my life. The thing is, if Eveltal goes down, I just lose. <laughs> okay, nice. I need more health. Oh God. What is this Solgaleo set? Flash cannon stat move? Okay. Um, pause champ. Okay. We're going to have to change the plan here because um, I clearly missed something along the way because now I can't really max this dude. I don't really want to give away my Grim Snarl for free and give this thing a boost. I'm just going to do this. Scary face plus foul play. It should give me a decent chance of That really correct truth of the matter is i really want to i really should i just wish i had more hp i should have maxed last turn that was my bad if i just maxed airstream there i was fine okay let's go for a scary face here for sure and let's go for foul play here it should be my strongest option i think i have both screens up which should put me at a pretty big advantage That's not good. I think I lose. <laughs> uh, I, I may be able to win here. I, I, it's possible. It's just difficult. Because I lose both mons here. Okay, I don't get a boost though, which is nice. I'm, I'm definitely losing. The problem is Gordon. That's the real problem here. Although I will say it heavily depends on what they go into here because I have one little sneaky trick up my sleeve. Why are you saying four wins? I'm losing. <laughs> it depends on who they go into here, right? That's the truth. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie to you. Is that Gordon? That's Reshiram. Okay. That's not good. Um Uh, I have an idea. Basically, the problem... There's a problem here. Um, I think it's most likely that... You know what? We ball. I have nothing to say except that we... That work? And then try and solo with Ogre? Yeah. I'm doing this. They're going to switch Calyrex into Groudon. At no point in this game have I had any idea what's going on. Every single turn is just another another step in this wild ride. Every single turn, I'm like, I know how to play Pokemon. And then stuff like this, like, okay. I have no idea. Don't ask me. Don't ask me. Don't ask me the color of anything. I have no idea what's going on. Okay. That's a Salt Fest. So that's good. We know it can't protect. But don't ask me. I don't care what happens anymore. You just, just knock it on my Pokemon. Just end. Just as long as I want to play Pokemon, I understand it. Okay. Where's my, where's my, I'm pressing this button. Wow. I know it's not relevant, but it's never stopped me before. <laughs> okay. Should have demaxed Kyogre and done what? I like this play. Play was better. Let me get more damage down. Ah, uh, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you're right. Is that the Asian? I, I don't know the names of Pokemon anymore. Okay, cool. All righty. Well, um, that's interesting. Am I going to lose? Whew, that hurt. Um, I actually think I'm not supposed to Dynamax here. Am I supposed to Dynamax here? Uh, I don't have faith. I'm, I'm I'm maxing. I don't have faith. Basically, like here, I think that if Behemoth Blade plus Water Spout KOs their Reshiram, then I should go for that. But the problem is that because of the damage on Kyogre and the attack drop on Zacian, I'm no longer confident that it will KO. Um, so instead, I'm doing what I think is a safer play. But honestly, I've made a lot of safer plays tonight, and it hasn't. Most of them haven't worked out. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Hey. 
Uh, I need this to two shot. This range. Because I can't max guard my Kyogre. I should just take this thing out. That's a two shot for sure. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Is it Quake though? Is it. Oh, we're. N yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. Tons of damage through Protect. I feel pretty good about my spot. We're going to get into Kyogre, which means Zacian's still at full. This is light screened and yeah, I should be fine here, really. Okay, we know this is all uh Rush Ram, so let's do that and then just same play again. We're fine. Um, yeah. Uh, the only way we lose this is like max speedization crit, I guess. And even then we would probably still be okay because my their, their rush room is slower than my uh what's it called okay yeah that should seal it up but i mean i've been surprised before tonight so who knows i think rush room could be threatening if used properly it did pretty well it did pretty well this season actually i don't think it's like objectively the single strongest pokemon ever like created i think it's like probably in the c plus or b tier but um i mean it's it has some things going for it it's very specially bulky with the assault vest I guess if I get crit here twice, I lose. I didn't consider that. Well, here's chance number one. Thought that was gonna go down. I don't think the other person played Restaurant badly. I think they actually made it pretty annoying for me. Um, yeah, I don't know any crit. I mean, the Sogaleo uh, counter stuff was really weird, but the one Restaurant came in, I, I didn't have any criticism of their play in all honesty. Like using Max Dragon, I think was correct there. I think anything else would have lost in the game. All right, one more to Master Ball, maybe? Probably two more if I remember correctly. Oh, one more, okay. All right, chat. <laughs> one more win to Master Ball. Oh boy, all right. This is it. If we win this game... <laughs> okay, if we win this game, we are Omega chilling. We get to Master Ball tier. If we lose this game, what should I do? Cry? Uh, oh, oh, they got some Azenta. What is the problem? What's the problem? Wolf, talk to me. Well, you know, I don't know. He's got this dog. I just, he's got this dog in me. Uh, okay. You Reggie like he has a pretty good chance to sweep through this team. Potential problems to that are Zamazenta, who uses Snarl. Solgaleo, who can set up Trick Room. I think Solgaleo is the most threatening. Kyogre, Zacian is... Uh, they only have two potential Trick Room setters. Basically, this could go really badly if it's Trick Room so Solgaleo, which it normally... Or what's it called? Necrozma Duskmane? I'm not calling it that. If it's the, if it's, it's the weird... No, they've already locked in. If they get Trick Room up, I'm in trouble. But I think that I don't think I should be bringing Mag Magirna's really bad here, except even if they get Trick Room up. I mean, the, the alternative was to bring Grimstone or Lucky, but if they lead the dogs, then I'm in trouble. Or like either of the dogs, then I'm in trouble, right? So I think that I'm supposed to do this instead. We just don't want to see Necrozma, Calyrex, and Amazenta. Okay. You know what? I can work with that. Um. I can work with that. Um, what would Wolfie do? Basically, here I've got a couple options. Oh, Lucky is so strong here that I don't. I don't really want to jump the gun, but I also have. I mean, I have the option, right? I'm just going balls. I mean, excuse me. <laughs> I think just putting this thing down to its sash is valuable. Let's see if they protect it. Okay, no protect. It looks like their their aim is just to slow down Electric Man, which is like respectable for sure. But I here's the secret to Reggie. Oh, they they I oh I can ex oh god. Okay, this is like a reverse. They want to like sweep the Fungal or something. It didn't kill. All right, you know what? I'm, I'm hitting the ghost sauce. It's time. 
because here's the thing even if they snarl me reflect what move are they missing coaching even if they snarl me um the electric train basically cancels out and i do so much damage and they have no ground type so I think that this is still probably the route I want to take here. The issue is this Calyrex. I went for Sucker Punch. It's so obvious. I don't think they're going to let me do it in all honesty, but I, I didn't want to basically by using Sucker Punch here, I ensure that I don't take that much damage. Worst case scenario is well, worst case scenario is Trick Room. Um, but to hard commit to Sucker Punch, it's possible. I mean, I've shown foul play. I probably should have Dark. No, I, I don't disagree with my play. Okay, they stay in. So the question is, what, is, what moves do they select? Because this can really vary. I don't know if we are balling, but I would like to be balling. <clears throat> it's an early max, but Regilecki is so powerful that I feel good about it. I will do tons of damage to Zamazento, who is really annoying because of wide guard. Fail Sucker Punch. Hey, what do they do? What do they do? What did you do? So much damage. I need this Zamazento gone. It's worth using two turns of max for it. It's probably Will-O-Wisp, right? <laughs> oh, oh. Badge. I am wondering if it's worth I definitely lightning here again the question in my mind is is it ever worth just oblivion winging here I think it probably is like I want this calorics off the field because I want to basically if they have Kyogre I want to force it in expeditiously Basically, here's my thought process. If they have Kyogre plus Solgaleo Angry Form in the back, um, I probably should just Oblivion Wing last turn, but whatever. Hindsight is pretty funny. If they have them both in the back, if they want to protect Kyogre, which is valid, um, I'm probably gonna Willowisp here, right? Not Snarl. They've already got one Snarl down. We go for Willowisp. Okay. Ugh. So I'm minus two Yveltal with Burn on me. Um, they have Reflect up. So basically my physical attacks are worthless here. Ugh, they have Necrozma in the back. It might be a problem. Ugh, okay, this is really like I'm up to Pokemon, but Aleki getting minus one. Um, I'm only minus one in Aleki. Wait, am I only minus one in Aleki? I'm only minus one in the lucky, so I'm minus one in electric train with a 140 base power max move. Ogre, okay. I've got a choice to make here. Oh, I don't have a choice to make here. Um, They've got reflect up. Ugh, okay. Basically, I have I have a choice to make here. Um, I'm going for max lightning. The question is... Minus one, right? Here's the question, chat. No, I think that I do this. Max lightning and switch to high ogre. I can't be correct, right? If I do this and I get it wrong, what happens? They would max guard and then I'd be in trouble. I have to go in. I just feel like it's such an obvious move to ignore the Kyogre here. See, I could have protected. That may have been better in hindsight. The lucky will not survive a behemoth blade. Oh god, I could have just, I could have just won the game outright. Oh no, they didn't even max. Oh, I knew I was the wrong. Move. Okay. Ugh. Electric dodge it. Okay. All right. Lord. Why didn't they max? Oh, I should just. I. That was the wrong move. What if they go for like thunder? That'd be so bad. Oh, I know why they didn't max chat, and I do not like. It. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ugh.
Okay. That's pretty bad. Um, that's really bad. Plus, this, they're just so bulky. Okay, so the last turn reflect. And they, the issue is they haven't maxed. That was a really good plan. Their part, it was super risky, but it really paid off. This is a tough one. This is a really tough one. They max. Oh God, I need to get rid of the station this turn. Here's the, the only, there is one upside here, which is that Combine Kyogre normally want to run Origin Pulse and Ice Beam. And if that is the case, they do not have a good move to hit my Kyogre. If they have Thunder, I think this is just Omega over. We need this to be, okay, Thunder comes out. All right, it's the three versus... It's probably a two versus one because Yalto's probably going down this turn. That's the end of the Zacian. Crit doesn't matter. Reflect also ends this turn. Dark Pulse is going to do a pittance. A pathetic. Geyser, okay. Ogre's alive for one more turn. Yalto did his best. Okay. Okay. Reflect should end this turn, I think. It's leftovers. Leftovers combined. Reflect end. Okay. So I have a choice here, basically. I can either protect Z like basically I need to call the target this turn. Because I a Kyogre is locked into Thunder, so I'm thundering for the for the near like for scene uh near future, right? This last turn electric train. I really suspect that they don't have I really think that they're just gonna geyser my Zation here is the truth. That's like really what I believe. And if I get it wrong, I could lose. But if I get it right, I would just win, right? Then again, okay, here's the thing. I uh, actually, this is, I'm gonna attack here because if they do have thunder, they're probably gonna use it here, right? So for that reason, if they don't have thunder, I should win the 1v1 anyway. Also, I'm just gonna get the para full, mm, that didn't do enough. Para? I'm gonna get the para full para, trust. I basically think the odds are in my favor with this because I think Behemoth Blade Thunder Thunder has a chance to probably do. Well, it's not enough, but it's going to be close. Para, 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 para. Oh my God, I'm so good. I'm actually unbelievably good. I have one more choice to make though. Oh my God, I actually almost didn't make that play. Um, do I think Behemoth Blade KOs from this range? I re Yeah, I do. I really do. I really do. Because I could go Protect and then Sacred Sword, which is also probably safer. Wait, protection to Sacred Sword is better, right? Nah, they get more leftovers recovery. Let's just, I'm pretty sure that this KOs. Yeah, there's no way this doesn't KO. Okay. And that should be Master Ball. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I think that was a really good. So basically there, what I did was I basically figured, okay, I want to protect Zacian because I don't think his Kyogre has Thunder, which means they want to use a water move into Zacian, right? But then I thought, like, okay, well, if their Kyogre really doesn't have Thunder, then um, even if they KO Zacian, my Kyogre will just win next turn, right? Like, because they will win the 1v1, they won't one-shot me, and then I'll win with Thunder. Um, so for that reason, I was like, okay, so basically, if they don't have Thunder, I win anyway, so I may... But if they do have Thunder... This is a new peak, chat. This is a new peak. Rank 8. Um, if they do have Thunder, then if I could lose the game by using Protect. So that's why I chose to Behemoth Blade. And it ended up paying off because they ended up having Thunder, which I was not really prepared for. What Pokemon game is this? And can what can you play it on? This is Pokemon Sword, and you can play it on the Switch. But you should, if you want to get into Pokemon, you should play. Um, you should wait till Scarlet and Violet. Hi, Wolfie. Have a wonderful. Wait, I missed it. Have a wonderful night. Thank you very much. Thanks for stopping by. I'm not tripping, right? You're the world champion? Correct. What if you just baton pass into rest slash BDSP Mega Evolve into Hop It? Hop It? I don't know what that means. Yeah, so we are currently ranked 8th in the world. 
um a certain community might say that this is an eighth but i have uh, i have hope that it can be more than that i have hope did paralysis matter not at all speed tiers weren't relevant there uh, i was already faster i'd scarf kyogre and zation who were already faster it had the potential of like i don't know maybe like if they if they had full pair of the turn it would have been guaranteed win but it ended up not mattering Yeah, the issue with this is that there's not many people in Master Ball tier, so it might take a little bit to find games. Like, we'll probably do a couple rotations. Also, the other issue is I kind of have to pee. What do you think of that chat? How'd you get so high ranked so fast? I went on a little win streak. I think we were four and four, and now we are 10 and four. Not to jinx it. I mean, they've all been really close in all honesty. They've been tight games. Are you guaranteed to rank up on a win? No, there have been several situations where I'm like rank two and I win three games and I don't rank up. But at this, at this, with this current situation, I, I will most likely rank up. The question is how many wins is it to first? I have to pee so bad. Oh no, I was gonna say, I probably shouldn't have started that. All right, this is the ranked five player in the world versus the ranked eight player in the world. I, I forfeit, I can't do anything. Sorry, yeah, thank you for watching the stream, everybody. Um, I really appreciate the support, but nothing to do about this I should probably try and win I don't think I can win okay looking at this team Aleki looks really strong but the issue is that Gordon right also charger bug is a problem I've played against this team like this before um I'm gonna make a read here I'm gonna play a little aggressively it's a little risky um but I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make an aggressive play here I'm gonna say you know what game I don't think you're leading with I don't think you're leading with Groudon I'm gonna say it I think you want to leave Charger Bug you're on stream I think you want to leave with Charger Bug and because I know that you want to leave with Charger Bug because you're on stream I think you're not leading Groudon I don't think Groudon Charger Bug does anything so I'm gonna make a risky play here I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna leave Kyogre plus Reginald who are very bad into uh our friend Groudon Gordon How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes. They're probably gonna go for like Electroweb. No! Oh! Bug's too strong. Oh, I can't even switch because it's a... Oh. Okay. Can I win this? Probably not. Um... Let me think about this. They are kind of sitting ground on right in front of me. Kind of using it as bait. I'm sure Charger Bug does so much damage is the worst part. Let me think about this. Hang on. Let me let me slow down here. Um and I could just water spout. Charger Bug has an ability called Battery. Um, it's also an Electro type, which is really good. The question is, are they going to max Grout on here? Okay. This was what I was hoping for. The question is, what's Charger Bug doing? Basically, here's the problem. Charger Bug makes alt. Wait, wait. Is Charger Bug for? It's only for special, right? It's only for special attacks. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I just really this Charger Bug not use Electro this turn. Not like Flame at all. I'm pretty sure battery is only for special attacks. I'm also pretty sure I'm in danger. <laughs> Chuckles, I'm in danger. Uh, this is a bad play, but I, I wasn't inherently a... Okay, all right, I'm actually kind of okay. Oh no, Electro Web, Sticky, Sticky Weeb. Okay, um... I have a vision, is it good? No, but it's all I've got, I think. I need this Charger Bug gone. I don't care what anybody says. This Charger Bug, I need it out of my life. Expeditiously. Best of the bug, you get the hug. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm basically forced to max Shivelt all here because of Sticky Web, which I didn't realize was something I was going to have to say today, but... Special ground, it is a possibility. Basically, my plan is simple. 
get control of the speed via Yveltal. Don't protect. Okay. I need this charge of a gone. It is the biggest threat, honestly. It's so bulky. What? Ah, it doesn't do any damage. What? It's so bulky. No, it is so. I thought for sure. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Bad idea. That's unfortunate. Tell me that's a crit. It just does that much? Oh my god. Oh, it's life orb. Hey. That's not ideal. Okay, that was the wrong dodge. Thanks, though. I'm minus one. I'm so screwed. This thing actually just ruined me. I can't believe that. I honestly can't believe that. I'm in disbelief. Um, I can still win this. <laughs> I actually could still win this. Believe it or not. I don't believe it. But I could. And the secret the secret is actually in my Reginald. Oh god, okay. Alright, chat. I know it looks bad. I know it looks bad. A little faith, please, okay? You ever heard of the world champion? Yeah, kind of a cool guy, right? There's no way I'm in charge of him. Electro string shot. Dude, this thing is so strong. Okay. Here is the here's the secret chat. I have a Kyogre and a Dream and a Reginald. I have a Kyogre, a Reginald, and a Dream. Here's the situation. Because I dodged that string shot, my Reginald is still at new plus one speed. So I have plus one speed Reginald and I have neutral minus one speed Kyogre. So my opponent probably thinks, okay, well, it's fine. I can go into Zation or somebody else um, and end up all right in this scenario, right? But the secret here... Uh, there is one potential problem, actually. The secret here is that my Kyogre is Scarf, which is excellent. By the way, that was the wrong play. No, I should have. That was a bad play. Um, the the thing here is that this Groudon never got max Quake special defense boost. Like they felt so safe versus Lucky that they never actually targeted it, and now it's going to be a problem for them for the rest of this game. I think if I have any, basically if I have any chance of winning it, it's because of this Lucky. Um. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we take out Charger Bug finally, and we now have a chance in this game since Charger Bug is down. I was worried about them switching Groudon out and sacking both Charger Bug and other Pokemon, but. Yeah. Well, lucky, I should have used Rising Voltage into Groudon there because there was no need to slow Charger Bug down. And, yeah, for obvious reasons. But Kyogre takes out Charger Bug. So it's three versus three. They have Sticky Web up, which gives them temp. Like, it basically it gives them future speed control, but it doesn't help them right now. What I'm hoping is that they go into Zation here and try and basically, like, play rough Kyogre or something. Okay. I believe, personally, that I have a 95% chance at winning this game. Because the thing is that they do not know that my Kyogre is Choice Scarf. And because they don't know that, they also don't know that at minus one, like because my Kyogre is minus one, ordinarily their Zacian would be safe. But as long as I connect an Electro Web here. They have other moves though, to be fair. They can switch Groudon out and protect and sack whatever's in the back. And get the sun back up. I go for protect, okay. I am timid max speed Kyogre. So I I really should outspeed this Groudon. I really should. I can't believe that. I am timid max speed Kyogre. Oh my god, they are jolly max speed Groudon and they won the speed tie. Oh, that sucks so much. I was so confident. I was so confident. <laughs> oh, that feels so bad. Oh my God. What are the odds? I'm timid max speed. Oh my God. That should have been guaranteed game, but that is what it is. Oh my God. They're lost. If that turn goes correctly, this game is 100% over. There's no, there's no way back for them. Wow. Oh, I played so well too. What a way for the win streak to end. Okay. And it's, yeah. And I was only in that position because of sticky webs. 
Jolly Max be Groudon. Okay, well, let's just forfeit. There's no way out of this. Dang it. Oh, man. It's not a speed type with webs up. If your scarf's guard at minus one is always one point below max speed without scarf. Oh! <coughs> really? Yeah, I guess that makes sense because it's it's truncated, right? Did I see their team? Okay, no. All right, well, that's a charger bug diff then. I got nothing else to say. Ugh. All right, we need to go on a win streak here. I think five win streak would probably get me there. Oh my God, wait, my phone has been full time. Oh, that was rough. That was a rough one. I just wasn't prepared for Gordon. Max speed, jolly, life orb Gordon. It did so much damage. Also, Charger Bug is so bulky. Empty bladder. Okay, if I don't find a match right now, I'll, I'll go into my bladder. Sorry, I forget that with the new mic, you guys can't hear me very well. If I don't actually talk into it. Oh, well, I really thought I was going to get P. Okay, the rank 13. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, this is not good at all. Um. Yikes. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, I want to do a Lecky here, I think. I think I want to do a Lecky Olangar. Ogre. Yeah, Veltal. Right? Yeah, that's correct for sure. I mean, for probably or maybe, or I don't know. Um, Nosation feels a little bad, but I think I need to do this because I have to respect their options. And then, yeah, from there, I think it's just... It may have been a speed tie. Probably not though. It sounds like it wasn't a speed tie. Thoughts on new Diglett form thingy. I think it's funny. Would Toxic Stall trick her be good? No. Another match with the full bladder not good. World bladder difference. Losing streak incoming. You guys have no faith in me. That's your problem. I'm just playing. I'm like Rockley with the weights on. You know what I'm saying? Whimsicott. You bring Whims in my. You dare to bring Whimsicott and Zation into my house? Um, I just gotta go in the offense. Thanks. Whimsicott's kind of a problem, I'm not gonna lie to you. This could go badly in a lot of ways, is the truth. I if if this turn goes hmm. All right, Reginald, we're going to bet on all Reginald. That's my, that's my general plan in most games. Rock, we took the weights off and lost. Right, listen, that's not the, that's not the point of the analogy. <laughs> you guys have no faith in you. I'll pee after this one regardless. It was a speed tie. Okay. Tailwind. Unless this is the world's bulkization, this thing is going to get deleted. Be gone. Be gone, Zation. I have no time for your games. Disappear into the night. <laughs> please die. Please, Zation, please. Yes. Bye-bye-bye. Bye-bye-bye-bye. Okay. That's good. Zation's the one of the biggest... Zation was the biggest thing stopping you all in the late game. So... Step one, get rid of Zation. Step two, waste their Dynamax. Step three, mm, get through Tailwind. Step four, with the Evolve That's the plan. Alternative path, step one, Reggie Lucky, step two, shake their hand. I mean, metaphorically, of course. Who is it? Oh, that's not good. Uh, I can explain. Ooh, that is quite bad. I'm going to go for max lightning and I'm going to go for light screen here because I've gotten rid of their threatening physical attackers. I have no idea if this is physical or special, Lucky. I would love to take it slow here in all honesty, but the truth is that if I make the wrong, like let's say I go for like max guard, which is like what I want to do. Um... 
and light screen here that and they and they just ko my grim snarl i will definitely lose so i'm instead going for light screen light screen and max lightning and oh the only thing that could stop a bad guy with a reggie lucky chat who do, who's reggie lucky do you think is stronger theirs or, or mine <laughs> Jeez. okay we don't want to see helping hand here anything else is fine helping hand makes this be scared uh oh okay light screen all right that's fine that is okay that's not good we're gonna lose <laughs> okay i go for light screen do we think that grimstar lives this i don't think so for a second i don't think so for even a little bit oh it's physical oh it's physical okay light screen is a problem because all my pokemon are special I didn't do enough okay um two turns of tailwind left my pokemon in the back are kite i didn't bring anything with protect into a tailwind team what is wrong with me okay hang on wait math scary face puts it at minus one max strike puts it at minus two i would still need more and this is my last turn of max right um I don't see how I can win this actually because I'm gonna run out of I'm gonna run out of juice. No, I got this. Trust. I gotta get rid of this one's caught, that's the truth. I think this is the wrong move in hindsight. Okay. They wasted their move, which is good. I made the wrong move here, by the way. I should have gone for lightning again because now I'm just in danger. Yeah, there goes my Grim. Yeah, I made the wrong move here. Um. Yeah, that was really dumb. That was so dumb. I, I like was fine and then I totally blew it. I, I like totally lost uh, track of the thread. I have to go Kyogre here. There's no other way. Ugh, this is bad. Um, Do I see a way out? Ugh, I feel like there should be a way out, right? They have one turn of max left. I like totally messed up everything here. That was a really bad play. Um, okay. I can do this, but I need to do is hit Reggie like with rising voltage this turn. And I need to go for an origin pulse. <sighs> Possibly winnable. There goes my Kyogre. Energy ball. Okay, that's fine. Just don't crit me, please. Great. There's the light screen value. Rising voltage should do a good chunk. Good enough for me. They're out of max. They're out of tailwind. Their Oleki can't protect itself either because it's assault vest. So now, basically, the position. Um, the situation is relatively straightforward. Whimsicott has. We've seen all of Whimsicott's moves. It's tailwind, charm, energy ball, and um, light screen. We also suspect that it's probably not light clay. They have one turn. It's the last turn of electric train. This turn, this we have to make this turn count. That's like pretty much it. We have to rising voltage and sucker punch. Actually, I have an even better play. We're gonna rising voltage and sucker punch. Okay, this should kill. And if it doesn't, I lose. Okay. This is why we went after the Zacian turn one and with the hopes that we could win the late game with Yveltal. We also set up rain. This is like a minor detail, but I set up rain actually early. Like I went to Kyogre first for a couple of reasons, but one of them, that should kill. Okay. Um, one of the reasons why we did this is because we wanted rain to burn, start burning rain turns as early as possible. Electricity has gone. That actually is in our favor. I think we don't like, it doesn't really matter anymore. 
There should be, if it's Calyrex, we win. If it's Kyogre, we should be okay. And if it's... I win. Okay, cool. By the way, one minor thing that I did here that was pretty subtle is I went Hyper Beam first, Strike first, and then into Rising Voltage. Rising Voltage is a lot stronger than Hyper Beam. Um... Uh, but the reason I did that is in part because a lot of those moves are caught tend to carry Citrus Berry. Um, so even though, like, I basically wanted to do less damage first, and so there's a chance that if I had gone Rising Voltage, Rising Voltage, I wouldn't have KO'd, but Max Strike into Rising Voltage did it. Um, yeah. Big damage. Okay, GG. Uh, no, Pokemon Company probably won't hover host any singles tournaments. Singles is not an officially supported uh, format for Pokemon, at least not with live events. All right, GG, I'm going. Uh, I'll see my rank first and then I'll pee. Who should I make a team around? Well, Charger Bug, I guess. That was a close one. Okay, cool. We're building some momentum. It's almost three in the morning. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm gonna pee. <clears throat> let's do this let's see where we're at we're at 50 we went 8 to 15 we won <laughs> back to 8 <laughs> all right here we go chat chats multiple chats How's everyone enjoying the stream, by the way? First YouTube stream, first TikTok stream. How's everyone feeling? TikTok stream is lit. Yeah, I hope you're enjoying it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Yeah, hopefully I don't need Charger Bug again. I feel like I'm beating anything else. Watching from Hawaii. Hello to Hawaii. I've been there once and it was beautiful. I actually was there for a Pokemon tournament for Worlds 2012. Good memories. 
great stream great stream for those of you who watch on both youtube and twitch what are your what are your opinions um i know some people are probably only here on youtube since we have more than we normally do Son, we're kind of close. We're get, we're close. We're rank eight. We just need a couple more. We just need to pass seven people. I feel like four wins should get us there, right? Save game besides Pokemon. I play a lot of TFT, especially recently after Worlds. Do you have the Ludwig emote thing? I do not, but I, if this goes well, next time I'm talking to Ludwig, I might ask him for it. You are asking about Wiglet. How could you not like Wiglet? It's cute. Do you change battle music background, please? Sorry, no, this is the optimal music. I apologize. Why are we on YouTube again? Just trying it out. No particular reason. Figured it'd be fun to give it a shot. Oh, I'm tired. I'm not that tired. I'm staying up late. Don't ask me why. Opinion of 7.5 for TFT. I'm enjoying it a lot. I think it's much more fun than set 7. Can turn the music down a little bit? Is that a commonly shared opinion? Because I can do it. It's not hard for me. thanks very much for the for the five dollars i don't know how like can you subscribe like what's the like twitch equivalent of subscribing on youtube can you become a member any members in the chat uh ah what that's so dumb i didn't even play and i'll drop two ranks i'm not changing the music sorry this is what i play with it's a little loud oh okay say no more say less in fact, turning you from 34, taking you down to a nice 20, 27, 28. All right, third time through. Hopefully, I can find somebody. Should I use a serving Pikachu for online fighting? Uh, it depends if you're trying to have fun or if you're trying to win. Are you live on Twitch? I'm live on YouTube. Oh, I can't find any opponents. I hate the waiting. It's the worst part. I'm getting iced out. I don't have the member button. They boomed me. They absolutely boomed me. Can I find an opponent, please? Garrett, thanks for the $10. What's wrong with your heart? What's wrong, What's wrong Garrett? What's the matter, buddy? Can you yell at us? No. Is it too quiet now? <sighs> Was it 34, 28? Okay, give me a nice 30. 31, 31. Dude, I'm, I can't find an opponent. They boomed me. It doesn't happen automatically. I'm molding. Oh, I didn't find anybody this cycle either. I already got Glacier to number one. I'll never do it again. Okay, that's three failed rotations. Thank you very much. Fourth time's the charm, baby. That dumb today? Oh, I'm sorry. Breakups are honestly the worst. I have a lot of empathy for that. Keep your head up, buddy. Uh, please. <laughs> please. I haven't played Pokey MMO. I'm not interested in Pokemon Unbound. Like, if that's if people like it, that's cool. But like, it's not. I don't care. You know what I mean? Worlds already happened this year. Next year, I'll be there for sure. It's in Japan. 
Oh my god, am I gonna fail four times in a row? That's honestly so tilting. I saw John and Jack were both killing it in uh, Fall Guys. I haven't played Pixel Mon Mine. Oh, I guess technically I did. I played it. I don't think the video is out yet, um, but it's not really. I don't play Minecraft. I'm dog I'm on Minecraft. Yeah, Wolfie Vods is the VOD channel. This will be on there. So if you if you haven't already, you should go subscribe to Wolfie Vods so you get the, the updates so you can watch it all. All right, this is five failed rotations. That's honestly kind of messed up. Dude, get number one quicker. I need to go take a shower. Dog, you and me both. Believe me. Believe me. Believe me. The good thing no one else is in this room because I am not smelling good. It's the game. What do you want me to do? I got, I have literally no buttons I can press. I got nothing. Five failed rotations. Five. My shadow ban? No. <laughs> I just can't find an opponent. The issue is that there's nobody in Master Ball. The pool is so small. Six? Six times the charm? Come on. Surely I'm not going to fail six times in a row. I would eat Wiglet for sure. I th I'm sure that thing tastes delicious. Come on. Will that fade inside? Come on. You wouldn't. You wouldn't not give me this. Look, I'll, I'll even do tournament. I'll do a compromise. How about that? Am I really going to fail six? I'm glad you had a good jog, Luke. Dead game. <laughs> Jarring with the homie saves water, but I don't know you like that. Sorry, bud. Beard tips? Oh, you don't want my beard tips, trust. What have you been doing? Mostly just sitting and staring at the screen. Man, that sucks. Yeah, it's fa six fail. I don't think I think this is a new record for me. I don't think I've ever failed six in a row. I don't think I've ever failed six in a row. I think this is a new one for me. Okay, six failed in a row. At this point, I'm not even sure if I'll find an opponent. This is no, we haven't had, I think we failed one queue before. Then maybe not even that. All right, this is the one. Seven times the charm. By the way, do you consider yourself the best VGC player that ever lived? If not, who do you think is the best? I think it's basically, there's, there's like, it's pretty commonly accepted that it's one of two people for the best of all time. It's either me um, or Ray Rizzo. Basically the discussion is Ray won worlds three times in a row, but he did it when the game was a lot newer in 2010, 2011, and 2012, it's still unprecedented. Like it's unrepeated dominance. No one else has, has won worlds twice, um, even, and he won three times, but it was in a very different era. Um, and just things were very different. Ray also like the game, it was just like, it's so, it, it, the game looks totally different now than it did back then in a, in a number of ways. I'm also, by the way, failing this. Oh, let's go. Um, and for me, you know, I've been playing since 2011 and I have like a pretty, like I'm, I'm the only player to have won every level event. Um, I've won Worlds. I have seconded at Worlds. I need to pay attention. I've lost at both the Elgas I've played. Um, I would like to beat this Dialga is the truth. Okay, let's see. Yvelta looks good here. I've been leaning Zacian into this, but it's just kind of a sitting duck is the truth. Zacian. I need damage though, right? Magirna and no Kyogre, but Yveltal. I think I like this lineup. Um, there's no Zacian, which is pretty nice. I just basically need to use. I mean, yeah. I think Light Screen's kind of important here, so I'm gonna do this. I kind of wanted to do um, lead Grimmsnarl Yveltal, switch out immediately into uh, Magirna and Light Screen, and let's just let Grimmsnarl go down. But it's probably dumb. Oh, this is the Sash Cali. This is the same guy as before. Wait, what were the sets? Was This is the Life Orb Dialga, right? I've seen this movie.
Mm. Yeah, I always light screen and then I'm just trying to remember why this didn't work last time. Was this the one I missed the no, this wasn't the one I missed the play rough on, right? I don't know. I don't see why it doesn't work. I'm gonna do it. Oh, I'm just gonna miss, right? I, I don't have a better option here. I need to go for play rough. It's gonna connect. I waited seven cues for this. Can you believe that? <laughs> Man. I'm one for three on player of Dick Ogre. <laughs> I can't even express how unfortunate that is. All right, there's good news and there's bad news, but it's mostly bad news is the truth. <laughs> okay, that's actually pretty nice in all honesty. Hey, okay, that's fine. I lose both here, but I set myself up for success, baby. All right, chat. I'm down two to four. I've got both screens up and a dream. I don't think that's enough. I don't think that's enough at all. Um, they don't have Zacian, right? This is it's it's Calyrex, Tornadus, Groudon. They don't have Zacian. The truth of the matter is that I really don't want to max Magirna here. It's just, it's just so easy for me to get messed up if I do it. I think I have to. I think I have to. That miss from earlier hurts so bad. Um, no, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to count, count on the miss playing. This is probably the wrong move, but basically, like, I think if I max Magirna, I always lose. So I think I need to max Shiveltal to have a chance at winning here. I don't think I can win this, though, honestly. After that, like, the turn one miss is just so devastating in this matchup. I also am not confident that I can even survive a, um... I guess it depends if Magirna lives Geyser through light screen. Oh, oh, wait, they made, they made a mistake. Hold on. I really need this to be slow, Dialga. Like, if it's got speed EVs, then I'm just super screwed. Also, slow Kyogre would be super nice here, too. Okay, okay. I get the KO on Dialga. Okay, and I get the damage on Kyogre. So I've got plus one Magirna. Hold on. Out. Pulse hits both, as usual. They crit me. I was actually fine. I was actually okay. I waited seven cues to get play rough miss turn one into crit Magirna Opals. Ah, oh, man, that's really unfortunate. Actually, I, I was fine. I because I, I had I had Magirna set up to. I was so fine. I was so fine here. Oh my god, I'm so fine. Um, I can't really do anything, right? That's over. I was so I was in such good position. I was I was actually gonna sweep this. That's that's wild to me. Yeah, here it comes, and then yeah, I'm just over. Dash. I was so fine. Cause basically next turn it didn't even matter how much health I had. I had max darkness into dazzling gleam, and then that's game I think. Cause I can't KO Weavolt all because of the uh, thing, and then yeah, no pulse. Why not? And glacial lance. Okay. Survive, but for what? I can't 1v3. I could have 2v4'd, but I can't 1v3. Yeah, I don't know. That's, I don't know. That's unfortunate. I think I played this pretty well, especially given how bad the turn one went, but I mean, that's just, I don't know. 
it's unfortunate and it's really unfortunate because it's three in the morning and they hit another origin pulse like yeah they still died max i wasn't gonna win this um i actually glad they hit that because they uh I was so fine. I was so fine. Oh my god, that really sucks. Okay, um, I mean, I'm, I'm glad that I found the Evolve Max play because that was really my way back into this. Like after the turn one, after how badly oh, that sucks. Oh my god, it's okay. After how badly that turn one went, like, yeah, because it, it didn't even matter if Station goes down turn one. It's actually like I just needed damage on Kyogre so I could sweep with Magirna, especially with Light Screen up, you know. Yeah, I was super fine. Oh, well, got one them all. <sighs> Crit through light screen, too. Like, it was going to do so much less damage. And I got to wait another 20 minutes to find an opponent. Ah, that's really unfortunate. All right, play until I lose again, all right? Nah, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. I feel like my luck's been especially bad tonight. I feel like it's been a lot of critical hits. Ugh. No opponent. Matches. Okay. Cool. I can't believe I waited seven, seven cues for that. This time for sure. This time I'm gonna find an opponent. Okay, I don't know if this is the opponent. He only uses one team. Yeah, this is the team I built for this stream. But I don't, I don't think I'm finding an opponent. Oh, man. It's the waiting is what's killing me. You know what I mean? Like, oh. If I could just keep playing, I don't know. It'll be fine. Yeah, I'm not finding anybody this rotation. Yeah, this is just like shiny hunting, right? <laughs> That's basically what I'm doing right now is I'm shiny hunting, but I'm, so, I'm hunting for an opponent. <laughs> Someone on TikTok says, yo, is this Wolf Glicky? 2015 world champ. <laughs> Why do people think my name is an E at the end? I don't get it. I know there's an E at the end of my first name, but man. Yeah, do we think we're gonna get we're gonna find an opponent this round this run through i don't know this is god damn this is bad
pour one out for me. One in 4,096 chance of finding opponent. <laughs> uh, I don't have any snacks. Can you believe that? I got no snacks. I kind of want a snack. Snick, snick, snick. Feels bad. No opponents, no snacks. I got nothing. I got nothing. What am I? No ranking, no opponents, no snacks. Ugh. I even thought about it. It was like tonight, and I was like, I'm kind of tired, but like, I'm gonna want snacks when I'm like at 3 a.m. because I can't get rank one in the world with Magirna. Should I go to snacks? I was like, no, nah, it's gonna be fine. I'll get in, in like an hour. I'm the best. And now here I am. Can't find matches. All the stores are closed. I couldn't even go get a snack if I wanted. You know what I mean, chat? You know what I mean? You get me, right? No snacks. No opponent. What is this number four? Stop cheating at little baby game. Fall. <laughs> uh, it's too late. Too early for the shit. <laughs> Opinion on Gallade, it's fine. I don't really care. I thought it was really cool when I was younger, but now I don't care anymore. Ugh. Dog, this is actually. You're not, I'm not allowed to multi stream on Twitch. It's not allowed. It's because of the terms of service. Let's be a YouTube video at this rate. Probably not, but I, I was hoping it would be. Can't find a pot. Dude, this is such. I'm actually told this. Uh, it's okay. No, I mean, this is just good, right? You know, everything's an opportunity, Chad. That's how I feel. Even when things are bad, it's an opportunity to learn, to be better, to practice something. So, right now, am I super tilted because I just waited? This is what? I've I found one opponent in 12 queues. My ranking continues to drop. And the one game I played, I missed player off turn one and got crit to lose. And it was over in like four turns. Yeah, I am. I, it's a little, it's a little annoying, but I'm here with you all and I can't control that, right? Just like I can't control if I get crit, just like I can't control if my moves connect. None of that's in my control. All I can control is how I react to the things that happen to me, not the things that happen to me. Sure, I have some influence, right? I can keep sitting here like the, the, the freaking monkey or mouse pushing the lever to get food, trying to find an opponent. That's true. I could do that. And you know, sometimes I'll get food, sometimes I'll find an opponent. But at the end of the day, that's not really what's, that's not in my control, you know? All you can do is the best that you can do. And if the result is a good result, then that's great. And if not, what were you supposed to do? You know, that's how I feel. <sighs> this is empty. I don't know why I'm doing this. And in some ways, the worse, the longer I wait here and the more unpleasant it is to sit here at three in the morning, trying to find a single game so I can lose on a crit again. The more the more opportunity there is to practice you know what i mean i don't think any delivery app is delivering snacks right now and i'm hoping to be asleep by the time that it would get here anyway All right, dog, I'm going to ban you. Okay, well. How are they? Is it a high user on this channel? I think my mods are asleep. It's up to me. High user on this channel. Goodbye. Pokemon Unite. Actually, the, the next video coming out is a Pokemon Unite video. It's a Pokemon Unite. Um retrospective you guys want to hear about the videos in the works we can talk about that so next friday is the pokemon unite one year later basically like i'll look back at one year after unite i think the week after that doug's not here he should be asleep um the week after that it should be the 
sword and shield retrospective the week after that it will depend on if the world video is finished or not if it is finished it'll be the world's video if it's not finished then it will be uh i ranked every single mechanic the pokemon has added there's like 64 of them um and then from there i don't know yet The Pokemon Unite retrospective isn't me playing Unite. It's a, it's a look back at the first year of Unite and everything that happened. Um, how many hot dogs you think you balance in your head? As a vegetarian, that's not a very appealing uh, idea to me. This is Q6. God, man, this is brutal. You can join any games that aren't competitive or multiplayer. I like board games. Yeah, I basically like I had a lot of problems with an editing schedule, basically just like stuff kept coming up and I had issues with editors. And so, um, okay, that's Q6. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, so basically we took most of September off to get ahead so that we could do, I, um, I brought, I brought two people on full time plus a full time script writer. Um, and so now basically the goal is to have a weekly video, a video a week, um, and I made sure we had at least two in the bank saved up so that um, I could like basically like start taking on daily up or weekly uploads. Um, yeah, so. But 10 minutes, I've been in queue for 10 minutes since I lost the last game. You fear the return of any Pokemon Gen 9? Xerneas, Smeargle, Incineroar. Do you have a day job? This is my day job. Well, not streaming, making YouTube videos. But you're getting a TCG? I've played TCG for many years. It's not really my thing. Like, I play for fun every once in a while, but not seriously. I'm playing the guy who beat you 10 minutes ago. Uh, how could you find an opponent? What the? F <laughs> this is ridiculous. I've never, this is you. I've played this game for three years. This is the worst cues I've ever seen in my entire life. And I've done many of these midnight streams. This is by far the worst cue. Okay, that's seven again, seven and seven and seven. I found one game in 15 cues. Great. I mean, just, just what, how many more of those? 20 more ranks times seven each is what, 144 more? Is that right? 154 more? I don't know. Oh, thank God. All right, just, just put me out of my misery, please. The number one player. I waited seven. They've got Magirna. Okay. All right, Wolf, holy cow. I'm not. Oh, wake up, you piece of. Oh, okay. Okay, let's figure this out. Um, Magirna's spooky. This is a trick room team. Oh, I can explain. They're not gonna lead Groudon. Come on. <laughs> You're not gonna lead Groudon into me. Come on. Every single time I've done this, they've led Groudon. <laughs> All right. Wolf Glick back against the wall. Ranked 22nd in the world. Playing against the number one ranked trainer. Now, if the number one ranked trainer wins here, they won't be surmountable. Thanks to Wolf's enormous skill, uh, it's not the points that they will gain from defeating him will make it so that at rank one, they cannot be passed. It's just not possible however if wolf wins this could be the, the change that he needs to really turn things around now just don't be ground on this me finally somebody with some common sense do i really want to give them this free switch ah yeah uh. All right, Wolf, it's a rough lead. It's a rough matchup. There's really no easy way to say this, but it's kind of just looking doomed. However, you are Wolf Glick. 
maybe with the right plays and the right mentality oh interesting okay that is quite a bit of damage on among us that's got to be a crit it doesn't matter because i'm doubling into it yeah that's that's mad to my one crit thank you very much but it, it did not make a single <laughs> bit of difference we take out among us turn one that's probably i mean that's probably the best case scenario in all honesty um yeah like i'm not sure we were gonna win this game without without breaking this mushroom because it, i just don't have any answers to, to uh that that thing so here's where things get tricky i've got a choice scarf kyogre and a very fast zation in trick room um now as you might imagine that's bad um Magearna comes in now we all know how powerful this Pokemon is um I think what I want to do here is slow play this right let's think about the long game chat I have Kyogre is very specially bulky that's good um I could protect here I could also just go on the offensive and go for behemoth blade like I will lose to get KO to a double up though um I think I want to protect here I don't see a reason like it's it's just so risky um I think also what we want to do here is we want to target on the Magearna and we want to max they are they're forced to they're forced to max here basically that's Magearna um they're forced to max here because what they need is they need to make sure that they start taking KOs um now I think that we did see Magearna earlier use max grass that is scary um the truth of the matter is though is that if I can get rid of this Magearna I might be in okay shape because um I have Yveltal to deal with this. I have Yveltal to deal with this Lunala, which is super nice. And then I have my Zacian, who I can preserve for later. This is turn two of Trick Room. We need to get through a couple more turns. Um, but Max and Kyogre here. This is not going to KO Magirna, but it might do big damage. The question is, who are they targeting down here? I, I think even a, I think even a double up into Kyogre will. It'll probably do about half, I guess. But they would need to hard read that Zacian was protecting, which is a very risky call. They do not protect. So the question is, who are they targeting down? Do they make the read? You have a steel spike that's got to be into Zacian. Zacian takes the hit. The question is, what is Lunala choosing to do here? Is it going for Meteor Beam? Is it going for something else? Steel Spike does a lot of damage. I would not be shocked if that's Life Orb Magirna. It is Life Orb. Thank you, Wolf. damage no no Kyogre if no one else got me I know Kyogre got me oh Kyogre's got me okay let's think about this now Okay, we're gonna sack Yveltal here. I don't love it, but it's all I got. We don't sack Yveltal, we still have to sack Yveltal. They, they, they did 45. Don't tell me that's a crit. They just high rolled me? Okay. That's really bad. The snowball starts now. Uh, that is a major issue. That is a big, big issue. They're going to hit another Hypnosis. They're going to be three out of three. I'm high key in disbelief. Uh, okay. Well, they just hit three out of three Hypnosis. And they high rolled my Yvelle Tall. And if that hadn't happened, there would have gone down. I don't think I can beat this Lunala anymore is the truth. I never did any real damage to it. This might still be winnable. I'm not giving up just yet. Magirna's plus one with life orb, which means it's going to start taking some big damage. My Kyogre's a turn to sleep on it. Okay, yeah, I might need sleep turns to win this, but like, 
I don't know what else to do, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's really brutal in all honesty. Unlucky. Oh my god, I mm, actually it's okay, actually it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Actually it's okay. I take it back. Alright, trick room is up. So now we gotta find a way through this thing. They're probably just gonna like protect and flash the hypnosis me again. Yeah, I consider that unfortunate. Yeah, they're going for trick room that's fine trick room goes back up okay this is really obvious but i want to make the move anyway okay I live. They shouldn't double me here, I don't think. Okay. This is the rank one player in the world. So I, I have an option here, basically. I have a choice here. What is their last Pokemon? It could be Calyrex for all I know. a really really hard read i don't know if i actually should do this i'm gonna need a one turn sleep on kyogre that's all i can say about this this needs to be trick room show me the trick room come on show me trick room let's go <laughs> sorry i popped off way too hard i'm definitely still losing this <laughs> I'm like, I'm definitely losing this. Uh, okay. God, that's so funny to me. I'm so sorry. <laughs> like, it was a cool play, but it doesn't actually win me the game. I'd have to get like every turn correct from here on out. Should take out the Magirna even with plus three defense. There's no way it lives this. All right. Well, I got rid of the Magirna, but now the question is, what is the last Pokemon on this team? <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. Got the call correct again, but it doesn't save me. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Alarex. That's what I thought. Okay. Um, okay, cool. So what are they going to do here is the question. It's tricky, right? Like, I mean, every Calyrex in this, in this game has had the same freaking item. Um, I guess I'll just go Behemoth Blade and Dazzling Gleam. Mm, I'll go Behemoth Blade and Flash Cannon here. Um, I don't think they let me just do this, but I think it's worth a shot anyway. I, I should have called that. That was my bad. I don't know what I was thinking there in all honesty, because they probably have to go for Trigger Room here is the truth. Oh, wait, no, it's fine. It's actually okay. If they... Magirna? God, got me. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, I should have gone... I, I've had a couple opportunities where they were very obviously going to make that like play. Magirna goes down. All right, Magirna's down. They couldn't go for Predict Trick Room because I would have KO'd them. 
all right Kyogre, can you get the double one turn sleep <laughs> So basically, for those of you who don't know, this is a one in three chance of Kyogre waking up. And unfortunately, it looks like that's my best chance of taking out uh, this, of winning this game. Kyogre, come on. Wakey, 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 wakey. I think if I don't wake up here, it's Omega Doomed. Unless it's like some weirdo Calyrex item, but then they'll probably just get the double protect and I'll lose anyway. Like, it, like it's probably Sash or Babbery, basically. Come on, Kyogre. Come on. Come on. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. Come on, Kyogre. Come on, buddy. You got this. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. <laughs> right, if nobody else got me, it's Babbery. Oh, God. What a way to go. Any critters? Damn. This was a pretty miserable game. Any missers? Any higher spermers? Oh, Glacial Lens? Okay. Okay. Oh, this is Trick Room. Just so much damage. <laughs> Trick Room, okay. Wait, why did that do so much damage? Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, can I win this? No. This game is now officially over, I'm afraid. just so much to Kyogre. Oh my god. Oh, they just go for higher star. Okay, higher star miss and I win. Miss, 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 miss. Okay. Well, I waited like 30 minutes in queue to go play rough miss into critical hit and then Lunala triple hypnosis into no Kyogre wake up in time again. Okay, that was the yeah, it didn't really matter at this point. I knew it had wide guard, but I, I was basically worried. Like, I don't know. I was worried. I was worried about something else there. Like, I, I couldn't not go for Opal's there. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't even have any other moves that could KO. Maybe they'll stunt and go for Hypnosis, but there's no reason to. I don't really think I played this one badly. I think I just honestly got really unlucky. <laughs> I, I, I could have been a little bit more aggressive, though. Like, there were a couple opportunities where, like, I could have gone after the... Basically, the turn one went for double Trick Room. It might have been better just to double into the Lunala. Man, that's, yeah, that's really unfortunate. Okay, well, I think that's actually a fitting end to the stream, losing to the number one ranked player like that. And I also don't think I'm catching up anytime soon, so I think it's probably good to call it here. Um, I think we have enough stuff here to actually make this a good a good video anyway. So, um, yeah, I think we'll make this into a video. I think that's, I think we got the footage we needed. Um, yeah. Um... But yeah, I think that's probably a good stopping point. Uh, yeah, um, I don't think I played perfectly tonight, so I don't think I can I can complain that much. Uh, peaked at rank eight, which is not terrible, though the queue times were the worst part of this by far. Thank you for watching. I think this was a great YouTube stream. We held pretty consistently over 4K um, viewers, which is really exciting for me. Um, and on TikTok, I think we had like 400 or something. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And um, yeah, if you have any feedback, let me know. Um, I think that's it. I'm going to bed. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you sometime later. Bye-bye.